What's up guys, Kills in here, and welcome back to the Nox Road Trip. It's been quite a while since I've done a Let's Play video on the channel, but I'm back in full swing, back to hopefully three videos a week, and then Saturdays I'm live. But yeah, we're back with good old Keith McCormick. He has been going strong. We built some stuff in the prior live stream. I am recording this the day of, which is March... 23rd but yeah i've got the truck loaded up with supplies we are going to go check out the Levenberg prison which so happens to be right next to our base right next to keith's home and lovely abode to be but uh yeah we're gonna go see what it has in store for us then we just get keith ready to go here and i'll see you guys there Alright, pulling up on the location now. Very short drive. Literally took me a few seconds. But we're here. Lag, of course, coming in strong, as always. Gotta love Zomboid for it. I saw a Zed on our way here. I want to deal with her real quick. There she is. Hello, ma'am. Is that a ma'am? Is that a ma'am or a man? That's a man. Okay. Good night, sir. Time to go see you how's that looking yeah never mind not good at all hmm okay that's fine keith is already dripped out with all of the gear he could need right now so he is fine i did bring a hammer with me because i want to try to level up my short blunt i do like short blunt i like short and long blunt they are i think my favorite uh weapon skills to use in zomboid i'm not that keen with short blade yet but i am trying to work on that Alright, we are here actually. Before we get into combat, since Keith is claustrophobic, take one of those. We don't have many. We have only a bottle on our person right now. They were partying out in the courtyard. I see those beer cans and bottles. I just kill you. That was very slow, Keith. There you are. Okay, why did he just take damage? Oh, his boots took some damage, that's why. Because I stomped on him. That's good to know. Okay, time to back up. It's already getting kind of hectic. This is my only escape route that I... Th yeah, this is my only escape route out of this place right now. So just gotta make sure we're good. Anybody outside? Should be nobody since I cleared it already in a prior video. I believe it was one of the narration videos I did. Still plan to do those every day, or not every day, every month, at least once. Hey, strength finally went up. I'll check that in a second. Keith is having some trouble here. He's not used to short blood. I'll knock that dude right on his behind. He's got a nice back there that I do want. Might have some loot as well. Let's see. I hear somebody. That's nothing. Okay. I hear you. Just hold on a minute. You just grab the bag. Use that as a loot bag later on if you can find the armory to this place. I hear them walking everywhere. I don't like this. Claustrophobic indeed. Okay, let's run through here. It's only you. Hello, ma'am. Big swings, Keith. Come on. Alrighty, so it seems that we are near the cell block. Let me just make sure I'm good here. No, I'm not. Switch over to the Kobe. Not that guy. Not that guy down. It's been a while since I've done live commentary, but I'll get back into it. Pop. This is how I started after all. Okay. Hello, sir. Where are you going? You, you, are you a cop? don't think he is. I think he's just... We're in blue. And these cell blocks actually look pretty nice. These prisoners added good for them here. Levenberg is just such a nice city. Get yeah, great infrastructure. Great police. Too bad they all died in the outbreak. I can't see where this guy is. Let me pull the shoddy. Oh, this is not good. 
Oh, um, no. Okay. Ooh, hold on. No, let me see again. Let me see. Hmm. Are you not on here? The Keith is pointing at the floor like they're sitting down somewhere. Ooh, maybe they're over here. Maybe not. I can't tell. Ah, there you are. Oh, I see you. Come on, into the light. Got a shotgun for me. I appreciate that, sir. M500. Very nice. Is that the one I'm using? It is. Nice. We got another semi-automatic shotgun. Don't have to pump it. Let's see. Is there another tower down there? Doesn't look like it. That's fine. I think we're pretty safe to head up here now, so let's go ahead and do that. Hello, ma'am. Sorry you got stuck in between the fences. Make sure we're good. Right, the good old zomboid music is kicking in. 8 a.m. The Zeds will be more active in about an hour, I believe. If my memory holds me correct. Ah, not much up here. Okay. Well, we can dismantle this. Wasn't all for not. Maybe we are. I'm not even going to check the corpses. I don't think it's worth it. This would be a cool base. Just the tower. Or the whole prison. If you're skilled enough to clear it. That would be pretty cool. But I think... Hey, don't do that. Why are you up? That actually got me a little bit. Ooh, okay. Back inside. Let's see what's popping. I hear somebody munching. Okay. I don't know how he's panicked out here. I guess the walls are too close for him. But I guess we have to deal with that. Somebody's munching close. There he is. Hey, don't do that, Keith. Your eye's not working. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're wearing sunglasses indoors. That'll do it. Come on, then. Very nice. We can hold off on the food for now. He is doing good. Survived for 27 days. Killed 100 or 1,168 Zeds. That number's about to go up right now. Adios. Could take a peek in there real quick. What is this? That's upstairs. I did not think that was there. Okay. The power is out. That did happen in the stream. Power did go out on day 26. A big lag. Ooh. Anti-riot pants? I don't need the helmet. Gotta stay drippy with the, the cowboy hat, but this. It's better than that? Really? That's like the best pants in Vanilla Zomboid. And it does nothing to my running? My, I might have to... Oh yeah, we're, we're, we're putting that on. How's that looking for Keith? Get the light on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're keeping that. We could also do the whole set. I don't think we will. Because I think the jacket is a bit better for now. I will take it though. Because that's, that's great. For later on. If I ever want to switch out. Ear pro. Other vest. I think I have one. Yeah. I'm wearing it. But good to have spares. Always nice to have spares. Okay. Let's make sure we're clearing here. I can fill up on toilet water. On the shower water. Well, I guess I can't. Never mind. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. What is this? Ah, here we go. Bathrooms. Fill her up. The water went out. That was the water going out sound. Wow. Okay. Yeah, day 27. Water went out. Day 26. Power went out. I guess it was meant to be. Uh, do I clear this courtyard like this? I guess I have to. Hello there. There's the main lobby. We did go through the garage after all. It's nice being able to record like this again. Hello there. Oh, that just opens up. Oh. Hold on, let me get out of here then. Okay, yeah. Front door. Nice. There is another tower. Okay. They've got some company. Almost 9 o'clock, so they will be switching. So let's get over to good old crowbar. And go to town. Population shouldn't be too bad over here, I don't think. I could be wrong. 
This is my first time in Levenberg. I see you down there. Oh, there's more. Okay. Oh. They are starting to migrate back in, it seems. Hello there. I'm loving this white background on the, from the snow. Very nice. Deal with you. Bam. My panic is starting to come back a bit, I think. I saw it there for a split second. Don't worry, Keith. You'll be brave in no time. If you aren't already. He's not brave already. But yeah, he's stout now? Okay. Hold on. I gotta check that. Yeah, he did go up. Strength level 7. He is stout now. Okay, nice. What does that give us? Well, we have time to look. Stout. Extra knockback from melee weapons and increased carry weight. Ooh. It's 15 now instead of 14. Oh, they switched. Okay. No more messing about. Back to business. I saw you. Hello, officer. You got messed up. Holes all up in your uniform. You are not going to pass inspection. Just dismantle that. Another duty belt. I don't really need them. Take that. Take that. Okay. Still on the lookout for how-to generators and the solar panel equivalent of that as well. Because we need to get some power going at base one day. Alrighty. How are we looking? Get some munchers up there. Might be a cop in there. Can't tell. Can I get close enough? No, I think there's just civvies. Yeah, okay. I'm still with these guys. Can't get enough of the zomboid music, I swear. So nice to listen to in the background. Good night. Come on, guys. I know you see me. There's some lunch right here. Oh, there goes the panic. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need one anyway. Take one now. So we're gonna need them when we go back inside. Pop. And boom. Switch back over to the short blunt. I do want to level it up as much as I can. Single fellow now. Ooh, triple. Deal with you. Nope. Alright. Pop. And boom. We need a smoke in a second. And goodbye. Get that going. We've got enough cigs for this adventure. Got more back at home. And we still have to move stuff out of the lodge. But hey, don't stop doing that right click. Don't tell me that's coming back. I thought I was done with that. If you know, you know. The dreaded right click. Ooh. I'll take those. Doesn't go with the fit, but I'll take what I can get. Oh, I have the food on me. Oh. I need to put that away. I thought that was in the trunk. That is my bed. Do that real quick. I should just put all that away. Except for the bag. I need the bag. Pop. And then we'll have a meat stick for now. Good old jerky. And I think we're good. Yep, let's go. Back to the front. That'll be easier, I think. I can also unlock this door. There we are. I have the key to the place. Okay, good to know. I don't remember getting that, but... It has been a while. I can see the courtyard. They got fitness contraptions out there. There's the guard tower. I'm wondering if there's an armory. There is also an upstairs. So it might be up there. Somebody's munching. Not getting me. I knew you were there. This is... Uh, visitor rooms. This is where they keep people before putting them in a cell. Holding cell, I guess, or holding room, not really a holding cell. There's more stairs, okay. Hold on, they're moving. Where are they going? If I have to, I'll pull out the shoddy. Hello, sir. Come on down. Step on up. 
Do you have leather gloves for me? I still need leather gloves. No. Crap. I'm still rocking these fingerless gloves. I cannot find any leather gloves. You know what? Do that beanie too. That could be a good outfit later on. I take it slow. I don't know what's here. Okay, this goes back. Unlock that. Okay, this goes out to reception. A little bit early on the swing. That's fine. You can just pop another pill. There we are. You came from outside, didn't you? Seems like it. Is this a bathroom? It is. Okay. That's fine. Water's good. Everything's fine. We're chilling. Cruising. Even. Even Steven. Okay, we can head outside real quick, see what's going on out here. Hello, you. Is that a present? Ooh, cafeteria. Okay. If this place doesn't have guns, it'll surely have food, right? Has to. I just don't know if it's all going to be rotten or not. That's like optimal range for a short blunt right there. Speaking of short blunt, there's some more. M500. Nice. Should I be taking the shells out of this? I don't know. They are good shotguns though. M500. Highly recommend that shoddy. Put attachments on it. You can make it look cool. It doesn't. It's not a pump action shotgun. It's just a, a semi-automatic. It's awesome. Nothing better. Except for a Spaz 12. Spaz 12, I think, takes the cake on being the best shotgun. In the vanilla firearms extended mod pack or whatever it's called something it's, it's something like that vanilla firearms expansion or extended something like that i'm sure uh let's head up here yeah let's go up the tower actually can i uh oh i gotta go through there or is there another way i might have to circle back or yeah i gotta circle back around to from the other tower and go all the way around so we'll do that last Let's see what they got in stock at the, the mess hall. Bunch of trash, it seems like. Let's turn on the prox inventory. Okay, there's some things on the shelves. That's good. Yeah, all this is rotten. Juice box, though. Made some margarine. Some butter. Everything else is rotten. Okay, was not expecting that. Why is this uh, back here? Hmm. Dismantle that. Take the wood glue, even though it's almost out. Take the nails. Okay. I wanted food. I was not expecting that. Let's see. It's like I... Looks like people are... Already getting their food on. Oh yeah, all this is just... Rotten. Potatoes, rotten. Pizza, rotten. Marinara, still good. Veg oil... What about over here? Olive oil. Even the processed cheese has gone wrong. That's when you know it's bad. The factory made cheese is going rotten. That's not good. Okay. We got some visitors outside. They're gonna be a while. They're on the secure door. Come on. There you go, Keith. Uh, flashlight doesn't really provide much light. It's already daytime. Well, that's coming down now. Get out the crowbar. There we are. Gotta know when to switch your weapons. Hey, another beta blocker. Uh, da -da -da, don't really need that. It's got a hole in it anyway. Take this, dismantle. People are moving. I see you. I see both of you. Hello, deputy. Better take a crowbar to the head, aren't you? Back up a bit. Shove. Dead. And dead. And gone. This is like blunt. I love it. So nice. Ooh, 1911. I could put that on the holster if I wanted to, but I don't think I'll need it. Wait, you're wait, you're a priest? And, and uh wait no, never mind, that's prox. Never mind. I, I did kill a priest though. Well, Keith killed the priest. I'm just here to watch. But you gotta do what you gotta do in this here a zombie apocalypse. What is this? Oh, somebody's breaking out. 
and it's time for more time for more appeals they are upstairs wreaking havoc or something oh here they come uh oh yeah no more than four okay there's four I can handle oh. you FBI you are hmm there's some more boots. I'll put those on right now. And I can dump those. FBI baseball cap? Sure. I can really do the FBI look if I wanted to. Oh, there's some more black leather trousers. I would take those. Those are very nice to have, even if they have holes in them. You can always repair them. I don't like these stairs. Too many stairs. Let's just sneak. Hey, okay. Should have checked my corners. Hello, sir. Time to get put down. You're a priest. What are you doing in here? Yeah, I don't like all that snarling. Get out of here. Oh, here comes the music. Let's get to work. Come on. Let's back up out here and then I can speed up time. Come on. You know you want a bit of Keith. There you are. Trying to jump me in the door. That's fair and balanced. Bam. And bam. And bam. Very nice. How are we looking? I'm sticking with the crowbar right now because I know I can trust it. Another FBI agent. Oh no, you're DEA. You're a different type of fed. Your jacket's good. Take that, take that. Farming three already have. Sounds like we should be good in here as long as I... The dispatch of this woman. Oh no, there's another priest. I think those are priests. Check that in a second. No, you're not a priest. You're just a guy. With a leather jacket. Hmm. Alrighty, let's head upstairs. Hopefully it's clear and I don't die instantly. Okay. Looks good. This goes up to the second floor. There is a library. Good to know. Let's get over there. I don't like this many corners though. We got a rec room out here. We got pool tables. Army might be over there. Yeah, there really were just four of them on those stairs. Make sure we're clear. We're good. Okay. Oh, come on. There you go. Good job, Keith. Yeah, this place ain't ain't bad at all. You can you can really fortify this place. Seems like we cleared it. Or there is still another whole section, so maybe not. Alright, let's see. Bam. Bam, bam, bam. Anything with a yellow triangle, we take. Take that. Bam. Bam. There we go. Got some room left. What else we got? Angler. Electronics. Cooking. Nice. Nice. Bunch of books. No how-to generators, I don't think. No, sadly. We'll get it eventually. We have to. Okay, was this the way I went? Yeah, okay, that came in through there. We're going out through here. I'm guessing there's an armory. I hope there is. Wait, this, this is looking like a classroom. Yeah, water. I'll take some water. Have to come back for those. They got a kitchen. Okay. Let's see. Take a bit of that. Take both of those. I can use those for recipes and things. Make some stir fries or whatnot. Another box of tea bags. I don't need two of those. 
Bacon soda. Can of oats, that's good. Looks like we're good there. These are all probably office materials. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Okay. No armory. Not yet, anyway. Kind of surprised. Kind of perplexed. Let's have another pill. Another beta blocker. Block them betas. Somebody's munching away. That looks like the warden's office. Another stairway. Unlock that. Oh, I see you. Okay. You're not a threat yet. <gasps> Here it is. Yes! What have we got? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is what you like to see. They're all, like, identical. No guns. I'm seeing that. No guns, but tons of ammo. Let me just make sure I'm good here. Yeah, sort that by that. And then we just do a little bit of this. We are out of space. That's fine. We can deal with that. The stairs down are right next to us. Let's grab all this. And then we do that, that. I don't really think I'm going to be using bows and arrows in this playthrough, but they're nice to have. In case I ever do. And there we go. Got the rest. Here we get out of here, because I'm going to die. Keith is going down. And he's, he's just dying. There's too much loot. There's no other way to put it. We still got to get this as well. Oh, come on, Keith. I do want to see if I can get that Jeep up and running, because that is a, a federal agent Jeep, I believe. Transfer this, I transfer that, and transfer that. How are we looking? Alright, good. Take a smoke. Very nice. Nine or almost a hundred units of stuff in here. Very nice. Okay. Let's go check out the warden's office now. Alrighty, back at the ward. Ooh, hold on. Hold that thought. Is this just surveillance? Yeah. Surveillance room. Could dismantle those for electrical. I might do that. That could be very nice. Nothing here for me. Got some wine. I'll take the wine. Anything behind here? Matches. I'll take those. Those are useful. Especially with the power out. Take some more water. There we are. Okay, let's see about this. Do I have electrical? Yeah, I do. Okay, let's get do this real quick. Alrighty, that's done now. Uh, is there anything else here? Oh, they, uh, they have a guard tower. And then we can leave. A very successful day. Actually, yeah, hold on. Again, please, if you will. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here that I can't really take. Uh, I mean, it's not really that useful. I have all this stuff anyway. But I don't have this, actually. I'll take that. That's the one thing I don't have, is that industrial propane tank. Other than that, that's looking good. Yeah. How about this? Good. And, ooh. Can't believe in that. That is valuable. Cannot be leaving boxes of nails around. Okay. How do I get to the other guard tower? Is it just through here? Okay, you're scaring me still. Pry it open. Nice. Nice. Let's go. Alrighty, here we are. Getting a bit peckish, but that can hold on. Oh, you're a cop. Hello there. Nothing on you. Pry this open. Oh, that was just trash. I thought there was a corpse in the corner. Okay, let's make sure there's no sneaky zeds up here ready to take a bite out of Keith. Looking good so far. 
Check those corners. Looking good. Alrighty, ready? Please be good. I'll take that. That is nice. Got two Molotovs, some ammo, and a revolver. The revolver, yeah, it's actually perfect condition. That's my... No, that's not. Never mind. I thought that was the 45 ACP revolver. It's not. But still, good nonetheless. Alright, I will see you guys back at the truck. And we are back. I am just unloading everything we got. I want to check out this. What is wrong with this? Why can I not have it? 93 Jeep Cherokee FBI unmarked. That's very cool. Gas has some gas. Battery's dead. We can fix that. What about key? Do I have the key? Do I need the key? I don't. I can all wire. Hold on. Cancel that. Is there a key? No key. Come on, Keith. You are the key. It's in your name. You are Keith. Okay, nice. Let's get this battery jump started. We can take this home with us. Let's see. Anything in the trunk? Military walkie-talkies? I don't need those. Do I? No, I don't. I'm trying to think of why I would need them. But I just don't. We can keep all that. I can have some use later on. Might as well. Alright. Let's get this show on the road. Where is my jump starter? Jump starter. Right there. It's got what? Two charges left on it? Oh, hey. I see you. Hello there. Just trying to steal this Jeep. Don't mind me. Alright. How do I use this again? Do I go in here to the battery? Yes, jump start. Battery speed below 10%, chance of success 95. Alright, let's do it. I'm feeling lucky. Hey, it worked. I think they used all of it. Yeah, it's gone. Alright, no, no more jump starting batteries. Yeah, okay, we're good. Let's give this thing a tow, and I will see you guys back home. Alrighty, we've made it home safe and sound. With the Jeep. Let me just get this door closed. I thought the jump starter was gone, but it was just in my in my other hand. So I put that back in my bag and I put that back in the trunk of the truck. Get out of here. Bop. Hey, look at that. Short blunt at level two. Good progress. Okay, let's get this in here. Back where it belongs. I should just dump all that in there. Bam, done. Nice. Disconnect these two. Very cool. I think I will start taking this out now. I just gotta charge the battery more. It's got good horsepower, I think. Gotta go check that with this one. And then trunk space. 110? That's perfect. Okay, let's see. How's this looking? 400? Yeah, it's basically the same. Alright, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. A lot of nice, all around. So yeah, definitely looking forward to using this nice Jeep. I mean, I don't really know what else, what else to say about it. It's just nice, black, unmarked, looking badass. But yeah, I think I'm going to leave you guys here. What is up, guys? Kills in here, and welcome back to the Nox Road Trip. As you can see, I am sitting on my roof of the factory base. And as you can also see, the garden is coming along nicely. This was part of a, a stream I did last Saturday, I believe March 30th, if I am correct. Let me just check, I am March 30th. Of course, I try to stream every Saturday. But yeah, it's coming along nicely. We had some rain come in the night before. But before I'm recording this. So yeah, everything's watered. We have water ready to go. It's snowing, so everything's good. I also installed two sinks under those two water collectors, so we have water. We're not going to die of, of thirst anytime soon, hopefully. But yeah, today I think we are going to go explore downtown Levenberg. Probably going to go down here first to the shopping center. I think that's a good plan. We also we have a lot more stuff to do here. We're going to see what that is. We got to go to this hospital. We got to go into the residential. Let's see what all this is about. Maybe. Maybe get to carpentry. 
I'm not sure. Maybe maybe Copper Tree like nine. I think that's doable before we leave Levenberg. Because that church is going to be nice. We just have to find the books to do so. We also need to start trapping. We need to find how-to generators. That is like the number one magazine I need right now before I do anything else. But apart from that, I'm going to go get the truck ready. And I'll see you guys on the road. Already, you're coming up on some new territory. I've not been down here yet. I've been up there as a church. But down here is all new to me. Bunch of lag. Oof. That looks like a government building. Hold on. I'm going to leave the truck on because the battery is a bit undercharged. So I need to charge a bit. But yeah, I decided to take out the unmarked Jeep that we found at the prison. Just because it's new, it's cool. And yeah, I need to charge the battery, so why not kill a couple birds with one stone? Alright, what do we got? Not a, not a lot of zeds, but you never know. Oh, I want to keep on leveling up my short blunt. Just so I use less stamina when I'm fighting. Good. A knight. What have you got for me? Take the bag. Always nice to have bags. Put that in the trunk real quick. As you can see, I've prepared some stuff just in case we need it. I'll leave the, uh, the jeep there for now. What is this? Big old building. Can't really tell what it is. Spiffo's over there, though. Uh, big leg. Makes sense. This is all very new. I have not been down here. Ooh. I didn't realize you were that close. That's my bad. Adios. Go to sleep. Very quickly. Thank you. Yeah, at 9 o'clock they'll start moving quicker, but for now we've got an hour of chill time. Just to see what's going on. Get the one behind me moving up. Yep. Keith is going strong. I think we're a month in now. I gotta check. Yeah, a month, three days, and 12 hours. Wait, has flatlined at 77. We have killed. 1,230 Zeds. We've got a few down here, it seems like. Whatever this building is, I don't know what that is. Might be just an office building of some time. Some some type. Can't speak, but it's okay. Not killing things in two swipes is kind of messing with me, but it's all part of the process. And a bunk. Hello, ma'am. You're missing all of your flesh on your mouth. You're disgusting. Get out of here. Seems like the snow stopped. Still have a wind chill, though. I'm hearing you two. Maybe more like you four, but that's fine. Don't see anyone coming out of spiffos. Ugh, the lag. Jeez. Oh, that's why. Yeah, that makes sense. It's safe to say I'm never going above... The first story of buildings like that. I just can't trust it. I had too many bad experiences. Alright, you guys can just... Rest up there. Yeah, this is just... I don't even know what this is. Just offices, I guess. Right? Makes no sense. Today is all about just seeing what's up with Levenberg. Seeing what we can find. Maybe there's a gun store somewhere, who knows. It would be nice to find. It would be nice to find. That's a cool looking van, looks Japanese. Maybe it's an import. Hey fellas, how's it going? Adult education center down there, I see that. Hey, lag, lag, lag. Always lag. Should really pop a beta blocker, I'll probably do it after this fight. A little bit too close to my for my comfort, but it's okay. There we go. I can't kill anyone because I'm being weird. There we go. Triple. Nope. Need you to die, sir. Thank you. That's just a long metal bar. I would just put it on the floor. I don't really need it, need it. I've got enough at home. The one thing I didn't pack was food. I'm just now realizing that. I had everything but food. 
It's okay. I'm sure we can find something. There's a picnic area on top of there. That's cool. Hey, yo. Okay, it was... A good thing I came down here. That's a nice looking truck. That doesn't look too bad either. Of course, that's a beautiful looking truck. Oh, yeah. We've got some options here. Let me take a look at the map real quick. It should be a shopping center. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you see me. Okay. We gotta be careful around here. So they can swarm me real quick on these cars. Come on. Speed up time a bit. Try to get him through here. Still have not found my leather gloves. So we're walking fingerless with some leather straps. Just kind of slapped on top of it. And good night. That's why I use the aiming outline. Okay, time to back up. They're going to start sorting soon. But soon, I mean like a few seconds. Pop. There we are. Okay, maybe it wasn't a few seconds. The timing is a bit off. Hammer is going to break sometime soon. Hopefully not too soon. That it looks like a perfect van. I'm finding a whole lot of stuff. It is now 9 a.m. I have to worry now. Let's get out of here. Switch over to Long Blunt. Bunk. Cobra's going to half durability. Which is fine. Cobra's last a long time. And bam. Okay. Let's see. Oh, the lag. What is going on? There's a spear in that, Zed. I see that. Come on over. I want your spear. I see you. Hold on. Let me just take this. Thank you. You got a... What's that? Some type of... Some type of short blade in your leg there. Ice pick. Hmm. Oh, you're a park ranger. I didn't even realize. Making smooth progress. That's a Humvee. Okay, we had to get down there. That could be our new main vehicle if it's in good, if it's in good shape. If not, then I can probably tow it back home. And that could be our little project for a bit. Try to get that thing up and running. This place is all booted up. Pharmacy. Lots of water coolers or water jug things. Water dispensers, that's what I'm trying to say. Hello, you biker man. You've got some cool things that I want. Switch to the short blunt. Oh, your whole face is gone. No wonder you were wearing the bandana. Oh, here's some food. Chips of chocolate. Chocolate's better. I'm gonna try to get my weight back to 80. Let's see. Perfect condition, yes. Take the revolver. Oh, you're a ma'am. Sorry, miss. What else we got here? Painkillers. We turn on the proxy. There we are. Very much. Can't go wrong with this mod. My English is not up to par right now. I hear you. Ooh, snow again. Let's get outside. Who just vaulted? Did you go through here? You did. Oh, you're gonna be banging on that for a while, sir. Yeah, I'm gonna just let you do your thing. Let's go check out the Humvee. And there's a food store right here. Yeah, look at that. Let's see, does the door work? It does. Alright, we'll come back to that. I need to see... What's going on over here? Okay, I see you. Oh, a little flanker coming out of the park. I see you. Trying to be a little sneaky. Not too bad. Keith has eyes in the back of his head. Switch over to long. Okay, one more coming from behind. Through the park. 
Oh, yep, satchel man. Or woman, can't tell. Looks like a satchel man. Are we looking? We're good. Just back up, back up. Pop a beta blocker. There's not many Zeds around here, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. Gotta be prepared to lose your zombie apocalypse. Bunk and a bunk. Man, that guy's gonna be a while. 100%. The Humvee doesn't look too bad, but it is kind of looking a bit grimy, so you never know. Somebody's munching. I hear you over here. We got a couple more coming out the park. Got some in the bakery. Let's back up. Hello, ma'am. And goodbye. Try again next time. Okay. Can I please check out this here Humvee now? Ooh, rain. Nice. Unlocked. Keys in it. Looks like the internals were broken. That army coat is very nice. Don't need the holster. I'll take it out though. Drop it on the floor. How are we looking? Ooh. Okay, it's not that bad. Battery's dead. Gas is dead. Other than that, it's not that bad. Get some 5.56 in the trunk. I'll take it. Yeah, this is this has potential. I don't think we can tow it right now, but I will mark it. Let me do that real quick. Ba -ba -ba. Bam. Put it in green. Bam. And then black. Add note. Humvee. I think that's how you spell it. It might be like that. I'm gonna go with that. Let me just check it right here. Since I can do that. Gotta be correct when you spell these things. Okay, well, it doesn't say it. it just says the model. The M1025. Hello, sir. You wouldn't have enough leather gloves, would you? No? Oh, that sucks. More boots, though. It's always nice to have it laying around somewhere. Who's munching? Oh, it was you. Okay, your audio broke. Okay, well, that's nice. We have a military vehicle here waiting for us. Oh, you're two of you on that window. That's weird. Okay, let me see. Can I grab one of you? I'll grab both of you. That works. Nope, stay down. Are you upstairs as well? Trying to be sneaky. There you are. Come on. Jump out. No? Gonna be weird about it? Okay. You do you, pal. Maybe a bunch of convenience stores. This is just on the map. I, mean, oh, I thought it was a map store because it said Maps Unlimited, but now it's an office. I saw y'all behind me. The lag is insane. I don't know what's going on. Ugh. All right, come on, guys. Little push and shove. That's all we need. Very nice. What else we got? Ooh, there's a, like a hot rod down there. This is very cool. They're going somewhere. Well, we got some company. The lag, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry if you hate my complaining. But I'm going to keep doing it because the lag might kill me. You never know. Keith could die right here from lag. Oh, there's one behind me. Hello, you. Dead. And push and die, please. And Sam is going to go soon. 
Where are these guys coming from? I think I got a switch. It's too many for just a hammer. There we go. That's better. Bunk. There we go. Another duffel bag. What's in there? Med kit and a tissue. Don't need any of that. Anything else here? No, not really. Siggies. I'll take the cigs. I looted the nearby is um what is it, Zippy Mart market by the factory. And it had like 300 cigarettes behind the counter. So I took all those. Those are all in Keith's possession now. Whenever he wants them. He is a chain smoker for sure. But doesn't matter. Ooh, this is a school, I think. There's a bike down there. I saw that. A bicycle, not a motorcycle. Kind of getting just kind of getting scared just kind of walking through here listening to all these guys banging on stuff so i'm gonna fall back a bit yeah there's people like you like to flink and it's not very fun and you where are you coming from someone else is here please kill quick oh you're in the door okay rain is coming down even more. I'm gonna start heading back to the jeep. There we are. Oh yeah, it's picking up. Time to go. At least my cops will be watered. And the blood will go away. I wanna check out this truck as well. Okay, we got some company before we can do that. Yeah, man. What did I just lose? I saw that. Was that the crowbar? Hello. Did the crowbar durability going down or did I just lose the stat? The trait. I can't tell. This lag is gonna be the death of me. I don't like it. One bit. Good time to rotate, rotate, rotate. Another bicycle there. Once we clear out the city, we can just bicycle around. Have a fun time. I need to get a pistol with the suppressor. That's what I need so I can take care of crowds like this easily without making too much noise. And without wasting energy and getting exerted like I am now. Pros and cons of using long gun. That's all it is, really. There we are. I'm guessing that's a bread knife, right? Yep. Always a bread knife. Let's have ourselves a little smoky. They just keep on pulling out of this park, I swear. This place wouldn't make a lot uh, a bad base either. Probably got a lot of construction equipment in there as well. Let's see if I can do this with the the hammer. Come on, Keith, you can do it. I right, broke. Uh. That's fine. Drop it. Back over to this crew bar. I think when we get to the hospital, I will take out the katana. Because that pipe is gonna that place is gonna be full of Zeds. Probably. Okay, these guys just keep on coming out. I don't know where. I just want to check out this truck. I don't care about any of y'all. Die please. All right, one more. Okay. Bunk. And bunk. We good now? Good. Let me in. What have we got? Take the battery. You should check out the mechanics. Oh, yeah, it's bad. Okay. That's not getting fixed anytime soon. The Humvee, though? Definitely possible. Oh, there's more. Hello. And bunk. I think it's just all these tall buildings that's ruining my frames. 
because it has to load them in and out every time I zoom. They're starting to regroup by the truck, okay? That's to be expected since I left the engine running. But it had to be done. I just gotta fight my way back into the driver's seat. You got a little shiv in your leg, do you? Take a look at that. I am not a doctor, but I can get it removed. Thank you. Take that. Ooh, hello. Okay, we're just gonna get in here. I can't fight all these guys right now. There we are. And we're out. Okay, I think to round off the episode, we're going to go and explore this right here. So we know what's going on down here. There's lots of Zeds. Needs a lot of clearing. Probably going to have to run the siren off of the Jeep and just either drive around or keep it like right here at the intersection and then just shoot at things and then hope they die. But yeah, let's head down here. I want to see what that is. It looks like a factory building. I'm not entirely sure since it's blue and not gray. I think blue is what community services. So it might be a school or something of some kind. But we have to go over there and see. The lag is unreal. Let me see. Let me zoom in a bit. Maybe they're out. Not too much though. You'll be able to see. But right here. Here it is. I'll turn off the engine for this one. It should be good enough. Well, let me grab an extra hammer. Gonna need one of them. There we go. Fresh hammer, ready to go. Turn proxy back on. It's a fire department. I didn't even think about that. This could be good for loot. Big loot potential right here. I just gotta get in. Oh, the door's right there. Duh. Open that up so I can get out. We should be good on exertion since I sat in the car. If not, we can always rest here. Hello. Thanks for your service, fire... Fighter. But now, the only profession is zombie fighter. Which is the way it is. Spare engine parts, those could be good. I'll take them. They don't, they don't weigh much. Ooh, there's some gloves. Oh, they're brokey. Okay, that's good to know. They're the black fireman gloves. Definitely worth... No, I'm gonna take them just in case we don't find any more. He probably will though. I also want to keep all this firefighting stuff on the floor. It does look cool, but it's firefighter beer, so it'll just make you sweaty and it'll be bad for you in the long run. I just do a little bit of sneaky. What do we got? Ooh, I hear you. Someone just vaulted off of something. Okay, let's just not have our back turned to that. What do we what have we got here? New crowbar. I will take that. Industrial propane. Just gonna stuff that in my bag. That makes sense. Sail type for a, a boat. That's cool. Another ball pane. Nice. Take that. I guess I can put this back in the truck. We've also got fuel barrels and stuff we can loot. Bicycle baskets. Ooh, there's a lot of good stuff here. Box of nails, thank you. More spare engine parts, JV can. We are still on the lookout for how-to jennies. We need that. I don't like it, I don't like it, like. That was a big spike. Where are y'all coming from? Yo, 
Uh, I guess you guys just follow me down. From somewhere. I thought you had a knife stuck in you. Never mind. Turn this off. Put that there. Bam. Alright, we're good there. Back inside. This is a nice fire department, though. Very big. Alright, let's turn that back on. We gotta fight our way through. These very close quarters. There's the stairs. Oh, they got a whole fitness room? Laundry room over there? They got a sick bay? Okay, this is this is very nice. I see you. Can't sneak up on me like that. I need to take a beta blocker. We're running out of those. At least Keith is running out in his pockets. I do have many at home. Yeah, that was the last one. Any in here? Why are there crossbows in here? Who knows? It's a fresh leather jacket, though. Long socks. Hmm. Do I need those? I do, actually. Yeah, let's put on some, some nice gray long socks. New socks are always important. There we are. Diving mask. Does that actually do anything for me? I don't know. I did get the key to the place. That's nice. Ooh, supply room. Okay, the door is wide open, so I gotta be careful here. Painkillers. Any beta blockers by chance? Bam. Take that. Take the needles. Getting all of these surgery... Um, magazine, so that's nice. I did not expect this to be a fire department. But it's definitely worth it. Okay, let's actually mark it too. While we're here. Do a little bit of this. Bam, done. Try to get through this quick and clean. Take the bathrooms real quick. Clear clear nice and all of the water has now gone bad in the sinks i have noticed that the only thing fresh are these the uh, water dispensers which i should be taking but i want to be a little bit lightweight so i can fight someone's munching like right out here i think or maybe maybe it might be upstairs actually that makes more sense let's take it easy get through here without a hitch they're coming down the stairs. There you are. There's also a firefighter going the other way. Hopefully their gloves are better. They're in better condition than the ones I got. Are you, even wearing, are you even wearing gloves? I don't think you are. Oh, you are. Yes! You've got gloves. Finally. I don't have to worry about it anymore. Now we just gotta... Keep them nice and in good condition. How are we looking? I'd rather them be the other ones, but this will do for now. I'll take whatever I can get. A okay, fitness room. This is very nice. Wow. I just gotta get how-to generators. Then I can take those treadmills and stuff. These washing machines and everything. Let's see. Let me check. Any good clothing? Not looking like it. No. That's fine. Still gotta check upstairs. Let's head up there. Actually, no. There's something here. What is this? I wonder. Storage room. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna have to come back. Maybe maybe I'll do it off camera or on an extreme. That's three industrial propane tanks. There is a lot. We just We need a big truck. I've said this before, I want a moving truck, just so I can take all of this in one, one, one fell swoop. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a couple industrial propane tanks. We've got tons of tools and crafting materials, military flashlight. Too bad. It's, I mean, I could take it. Let me see. How good is military? Yeah, that's good. That lights up the whole room. Let me just do a little bit of that. 
how does that look on on Keith? Okay, it's it's kind of goofy, but I think that's the best flashlight I'm gonna get. Put that away. Replace this. And then do the rid of this. Please use the right one. It did. Nice. And then we favorite that. And then we put it back. Cool. Yeah, there is just a lot of stuff here. Take the gas can, so. It was always nice to have a flare. I don't think I need a flare. Hand crossbows, I hate. Panic is set in, because claustrophobia. These episodes are going to be a bit longer, it seems, than normal. So let's go upstairs. Hey, you're new. Like both of you came through the window. Get out of here. Alright. Upstairs time. Hopefully they're not camping the stairs. The storm is starting to rage a bit more. Okay, we're good. We're good. We can, that's our escape door if things go wrong. Ooh, is that a gas mask? It is. We are upgrading Keith. Right here and now. Okay, the gloves are bad, but that, yes. We can use that for big piles of corpses, maybe at the hospital. Drop all this on the floor. There we go. There we got a buoy. That's cool. I don't think I need a buoy. Kind of landlocked right now. Compression t-shirt, another diving mask. Hmm. Nothing else in here. Nice. So far, so good. See the cafeteria or lunchroom or something over there. Molotov, thank you. Don't know why a fire department would have one of those, but they do. I'm, I'm not judging, I'm just stating facts. Anything here? Nope. Just the Molotov and the smoke bomb. Bathroom's clear, looks like it. Yep. Someone's still munching. <laughs> Coffee machines, I've been looking for these. Okay, we'll take one. We need ourselves a coffee maker. We can use that for coffee or tea, I think. We'll leave that there. Because these are going to weigh a ton. Actually, they weigh the same. Hmm. I thought the rice weighed a lot more. Just some chocolate chips. I'll take all of this. You're out of space. Gotta be careful. Someone is downstairs. Coffee Express, you come with me. It's nice. We're making good progress. We have. We are. Everything we get here is just. It's gonna be so nice for the base. Like, I don't even need all this food. I'm just gonna eat. How are we looking? Yeah, we're gonna gain some. Some arrows. There we go. Double arrows. That'll work. And then rotten food is also very useful now that we have the garden. We can turn it into compost. Is it a janitor's closet? Absolutely. Where the trolley? I don't really think I need another trolley. Right, who's munching? You've been bothering me. There's a rec room. This is so cool. I love this map. Or, the, or this town. I love this game. Just the whole game. Okay, they're either outside or now below me. They could have moved. The bathroom. And we're back out here. Take a little smoke break. Car is still good. They're banging on something. I don't know if that's the garage doors or what. That's a cool looking car. That's a double decker bus. Okay, very cool. There was something right there. I can't see it though. Parking lot. Can I see anymore? Another one of those vans, but nothing else. That's fine. Alright, let's start heading back home. Oh, I did not see you. That's my bed. Come on, sir. Please. Bye-bye. Ah, -bye. Uh, you got the gloves I want, but they're in bad condition. Drop all that on the floor. Dang it. Well, at least we got 
gloves. We could have left here without any gloves, but we got some good ones. Ooh, actually, we still have a chance. Hold on. Double kill. Alright, whatever we got. Just give me gloves. That's all I need. Gloves, gloves, gloves. It's not looking good. Hey, plus one in sprinting. Yeah, it's not looking... Yeah, no gloves in sight. Now I have one more spot I can check right here. The men's dressing room. Pipe bomb? Uh, I'm gonna drop the smoke bombs. I don't think I'm gonna use those. I'd rather have offensive than defensive for Zeds. Wait, what, are, what is the smoke bomb gonna do to a horde of Zeds? Honestly. It might confuse them. But you can just run away. Yeah, hey, there we go. Okay. Oh, no black gloves. That's fine. We can. We still have more chances. We still have a whole map to go through. Oh, you locked back towards me. That was not fun. All right, I'm gonna head home, and I will see you guys there. Already back home. Rain is still going strong. How are we looking at our stats? Wait, it's going up. 1,332 Zeds killed. Survived for one month, three days, 19 hours. Very nice. What is up, guys? Kills in here, and welcome back to the Knox Road Trip. So, I've been doing a little research on the city of Levenberg, and I found out that if we look at the map, there is a gun store right here. There's also a gas station there. But, yeah, I want to go see what's up with that. We have to go straight down, almost, almost completely straight down to the gun store. We've cleared out to about here, where the fire station is at, and that double-decker bus, we have not been over there. So we have to go check that out as well. But yeah, I'm gonna go get the, the unmarked jeep ready to go, and I'll see you guys on the road. Alrighty, we are by the fire station. The lag is unreal, as always. Let me see if I can zoom in a bit. There we go. Don't want to zoom in too much. Because I need to be able to see what's in front of me. There's a big old storage thing here. Wow. Another Humvee. Okay. Very cool. You have to go down here, I think. Uh, let me get the engine on. We're gonna need the Jeep. Hello there, sir. First kill of the day. Take a look at my stats right after this. Look at Keith's stats. I should say weight is, weight is going up. Zombies killed. 1,341. So for one month, five days, 12 hours. Very nice. Let me take a look at the map. Where are we? Should be pretty close. Yeah, it's right down here. Okay, nice. Let's go take a look at this Humvee first. There's a Zed Eaton right there. Hopefully this place isn't too bad. Doesn't look like it. Big old office space. We saw that in the last episode. Well, one of them at least. Hello, you. What do we got? Ooh. I don't, th I don't really think I need a tow bar. Take the fix a flat though. I can see the trunk from inside, and that's pretty neat. Well, I'll take this battery. I don't think this is going to be in good condition based on how it is right now. Seems like the it's, it's seen better days, definitely. Where is the trunk or the, the hood? Here we go. Yeah, it's not looking good. Oh well. Well, at least the other one is in better condition. We can always swap out parts from either or. To get one working. Okay, let me jump out of the, the seat to kill this guy. Or oh, this woman, sorry. Hello, ma'am. Time to go night night. Let me switch over to the hammer. Don't want to be exerted right away. Looks like we're fine. We got some over there. They might wander over. So, you know what? To be safe, just gonna get rid of them now. If they actually know, we're good. Never mind. Very nice. They decided to just forget about me. It looked like they were coming over. At least one of them was. Maybe if they hear the engine, they might run over here. Or slowly shamble, I should say. They are switching to fast shamblers in about a, 10 minutes. Maybe stop the engine here. If they just switched over. 
This should be where we're supposed to be. This building right here. The brick wall. I We might need the sledgy if they haven't broken it open already. Because they're usually covered in protective uh, barriers, I guess. I don't... Like shutters. I guess that would be the, the better word for that. But let's see. It should say army surplus on the side. Yep. Ready prep, army issue surplus. Hello, sir. Where did you come from? You jumped out the window, didn't you? And I've made a community post, which is now a week ago by the time this video is up. But I think I've put, I think, five more mods into the mod list that are very nice. You saw me use one earlier where I clicked on the on the stress moodle and it actually made Keith smoke a cigarette. It is very cool. I think that's called Medical Meister. Oh, hello you. Got a pharmacy there. Looking clear so far. Oh, hey. That second floor might be an issue. No panic yet. That is a good sign. Okay, you back off. One behind me. One over there. Okay. Hold on. Switch over to the Kroby. Bop. There we go. Why am I not hearing that sweet Project Zomboid music? Is it on? No, it's not. Look at that. Bam. Fixed it. Alrighty, let's get this off. So that I don't have to deal with you later. Take some beta blockers now. The road is looking clear. Is this open? No. Okay. Right. You got this, Keith. Big strong man. Adios. Alright, this is it. I don't know where the guns are stored. Seeing as this is open, they might not be in here. Ooh. I see it, though. It's back there. Okay, we got some munchers down here. I'm just back out outside. Don't want to get stuck in there. That's a death trap waiting to happen. Get some zeds down the way. I'm hoping... Oh, uh, like... I'm hoping that we can just be in and out clean for this episode. I just want to stock up on everything that's here so that when we do start shooting, like, up the hospital, there's no other way to say that. It sounds wrong. I'm not a terrorist. It, it's a zombie game. Please don't give it to my channel. But yeah, we need guns and ammo and just gear so that we can clear out this city. Ooh, bows. Bows and tents and things, lots of camp, uh, camping materials. CK torch, windbreaker vest. It is pretty windy out right now. I'll tell you what. Mannequins, I could use these for friends. Give Keith a couple friends. I did, if you saw in the intro, I don't know, I might have been zoomed in too much. But I have made some friends for Keith. Okay, let's take it easy. Start moving, let me turn this on, here we go. Actually, see what we're doing here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, a silencer? Yes, please. I've been waiting for one of them. Let's see, can I put it? Mm, is this what type of suppressor is this? Okay, it's that one. So that means it has to go there. And then I can do it. Yes. Yeah, we have got a suppressed shotgun. Let's take a look at that real quick. Oh, I gotta stand up. Look at that. If only we had a flashlight on it, that would be the best, but this military flashlight is already doing a perfect job. It lights up any room. So yeah, we can use this whenever now. We don't really have to worry about sound. It doesn't stop all the sounds, but it stops a lot of it. Yeah, there is a lot of guns here. That's a new one. I haven't seen that carbine before. Or 9244. Shoots 44 Magnum. Very cool. More silencers. I don't think I'm going to take all the bows. I might take one. I don't have a bow. I have a lot of crossbows, but no bows. But we'll see how much I can carry. Little break room. What do we got? Grill bush? Hmm. Take the roasting pan. Can't have enough of those. Some lard. Eh, I don't need any more mugs. I've got enough. I think I got like three. Three or two. Something like that. Okay, well, hold on. I just saw the mother load of guns. I at least hope it is. Let's go, let's go take a look at that real quick. Um, 
dear God, we've been blessed. I want to. I gotta. I gotta talk to you guys directly right now. We have been blessed. I am glad that I found this place in my research. Let us pray to Spiffo that this place is full of stuff. Okay. So fingers crossed. Pray to Spiffo. Get that done and let's go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have a heart attack. We are good. We are good for the whole city. What's in here? Shovels. Batteries. Okay, there's, there's not much in here. But the metalworking stuff is nice. The ropes I can take. Let's take another beta bucker. They are upstairs. I do hear that. I do have to get the jeep down here. Jeep, you're gonna be overflowing with loot by the end of this. 110 space. I hope that's enough. If I have to, I'll fill up the seats, but I really don't want to do that. I've, I can fill up the back ones, but not the, not the front passenger. Okay, let's get you to the... So much of the... I can actually just keep him here. Just turn him around right here. Back door works. That's perfect. Right here. Okay, the front door is blocked, it seems like. Okay, yeah, that's my bed. Alright, we just gotta clear out the rest of the building. Gotta go upstairs. What's in here real quick? My curiosity is getting me getting the better of me. Knife sheath, more bows. Nice. Okay. My voice seems to be going away. Maybe I don't know. It does seem like it's going away. If I if I voice cracking things, I'm sorry. I th I was playing a lot of siege today with a couple of friends. And I really, I really like calling out everything. I'm a good intel player. But yeah. Let's go up here. They are breaking down a door somewhere. I have to be careful. Alright, stairs. Don't fail me now. Please don't fail me now. Thank you, stairs. Appreciate it. Bonk. Oh, I hear a lot of zeds. I don't like the amount of zeds I'm hearing. One bit. Not one bit. This is a nice second floor though. I like this. If I wasn't based up in the factory, this would be real nice. Take the duct tape. Duct tape is always good to have. For general repairs and things or weapons. Dear lord, there's even more stuff. I should probably be focused on the weapons, but I can't give this up. Here's the key to the place. Another lighter. Oh, there was some more stuff there. Rice and zombie bombs. I'm still not sure of the zombie bombs. I don't want to eat them because I don't want to die. That seems like a like a trick candy. Like if I, if I eat that, I'm going to get infected. Because it gives like, how much was that? Um, yeah, plus 70 unhappiness. Ooh, a duffel bag. Can use that for my loot. Very nice red sheets. If only I wasn't a blue color scheme this run. That would be nice. Yeah, this place is real good. If you ever come to Levenberg, I highly recommend this place. Ooh, also, I also got leather gloves. I finally did that. I got it right next to the to our base, actually, in the the first apartment building. Let me show you guys that when we get back um, home. But for now, this site is clear. We gotta go check out the other side. I don't like the amount of Zeds I'm hearing. We also, oh, I need that TV as well. So many good things here. Okay, it sounds like they're on the other building. That's good for me. It's gotta be quiet. A lot of red rooms. I'm messing with it. Okay, we need another beta blocker going. The lag is immense. But we will push through. Ah. Hopefully it's not this bad in other cities. Don't need a leather jacket. What about here? Nothing. Great. Mm, complete cooking guide. I already read that. Ah, well. Cool book though. And then, kitchen. We gotta share some beer, brother. Yes, sir. Are we looking looking good? 
Pancake mix. Got some soda. Drink the soda now. Oh, hello, sir. Didn't see you there. At least you can't see me. Dismantle this flashlight. Okay. It's time for the guns once I unload all this stuff into the trunk. We're making a swift progress. Head back through here. Don't see me, please. That would not be very cool of you. Oh, God. Okay, hold on. You guys need to go away. It's very windy out. Where'd you come from? Come on. Die. Thank you. Adios. They're looking good. They definitely heard me. They are breaking down doors now. Stop all this real quick. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly, quickly. We'll take the bag. Secondary. Okay. We're almost out of space. This is why we need a bigger vehicle. We need a truck. A big truck. Do I start in here? I think I do. Let's get it. I'll dump that hinge and stuff. There we go. Bam. Okay, that's it. That's four of them done. That's a lot of ammo. This is so nice. We are good. We are solid. We just gotta get it all home. Okay, we are full up on space. Kinda surprised Keith can still move like this. Alright, come on, Keith. Put it away. Good stuff, good stuff. Okay, yeah, the trunk is full. That's not good. But we can deal with it. Let me fill up the rear left seat. This is going to have to be multiple trips, I feel like. 100%. Okay, now I got to fill up the rear left or rear right. We good? We're good. Then I got to exit, please. Let me kill you. Okay. Still good, still good. Let's go. Back in to the loot. This is so many crates as well. Crates and lockers. Insane. I can pick these up, right? These are all 100% pickup rates. Wow. Okay. If, if we can get all these back home, that'd be insane. I don't think we're going to be able to do that today. But we can definitely look forward to it. Okay, we don't need the sheath. I have one of those. We'll take that bow. And then take all this. Proxy inventory coming in clutch. Okay, that one's done. Someone is munching out here. Take a smoke before we go out there. And a beta blocker. There we are. Water is about halfway. They're starting to flood out the apartment, it seems. Just kill you real quick, and then we'll head home, dump all this stuff, and come back. Let me just see what I can do here. Might run with the Glock. That Glock also has ammo in it, nice. Then put stuff in the glove box as well. that in there okay let's head home real quick dump all the stuff out in the driveway then come back here and i can show you guys where i got some cool stuff okay so right here i think it was the third floor i got a leather gloves that was the one thing but i also got a how-to generators so we have power in the base i just haven't well i did mess with it i did turn off all the unnecessary lights so that we can conserve our power a bit i will turn it on at the end of the episode because i don't want to waste gas because we don't have another generator at a gas station to get gas we need to do that 
Let's just dump everything here, though. And close the gate. And turn off the engine as well. We are making swift progress here. I'm pretty sure I've already said it, but we are, really. Okay, I gotta make sure I don't drop the wrong things. That stays. That stays. That stays. That stays. That stays. And that. 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 I think it's it. Nope, wait. And that. Dump the rest. Actually, some of that food. I will take back. Chips and cereal. I think that was supposed to be in there. Nice. Okay, I should pretty. I should probably put this in the glove box, but it is 50 pounds, 50 units, whatever. So it wouldn't fit either way. Cause yeah, the glove box only holds, I think 26. That sounds right. Oh, it's 13. Never mind. Let me do a bit of this. Dump it all on the floor. Already, all the loot is on the floor. I will see you guys back at the army surplus. Alright, we are back. I want to make sure we're clear before I commit to driving all the way through here. Let me see. I am worried about this big complex here. So every time I walk through here, it lags a little bit. Not fun, tell you what. Everything else is pretty fun. The lag, not fun. Please die, sir. Uh, one more. Come on. Goodbye. Okay, we are looking good. Let's get the cheap back in here. And hopefully we can take everything else. Because if this is if this if I can make this the last trip, that would be nice. Turn it around, Keith. To a clean turn. Park up right here. Engine off. You're trying to pinch me in here. Can't be having that. Up into the wind. Well, let me back up a bit. Oy. Take another beta blocker. Can't be having those betas messing with us. You gotta block them all. Up oh, one more. Take out the crowbar. Okay, way more than one more. That's three. I could bust out the shotgun. It is suppressed now. I think it'll be fine. Nice job, Keith. I'm playing with multi-hit is so nice. I definitely won't do it for each or for each series going further, but it is nice to switch it up even every now and then. Goodbye, sir. All right, looking good. Put that back on the secondary. So what? What have we got left? Just the the main thing out here. Looks like it. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's see. Take that. That, 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 Ooh, that's new. And that. Super speed to Keith. Nice. Don't need another bow. They don't think I am going to be using the string bows. I think I'm going to, if I'm going to use a bow, I'm going to use the compound bows. Or the crossbows, I mean. I don't know if there are compound bows. Those might actually be the compound bows in there. Someone's munching. Let me just be quiet. Keith, you gotta put it all this away now. Pronto. Vamanos. Oh, that's why. You didn't see me. Let me just put this away. Bonk, I'm on the head. Bye bye. How are the skills looking? Short Blunt is going to two and a half right now. It'll be on three. Fairly soon. I don't know about this episode, but it'll get there soon enough. Don't eat the canteen. Let me switch it back. Someone is very close on this wall. That's scary. Take that, 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 that. 
Hope I'm not annoying y'all. There we go. What else have we got? Oh, silencers definitely need those. M500, and this should be it. Then we can take these for our base. They are they do have a chance to break, so we will have to be careful or increase our carpentry skill. I think that's what those are based upon. But those right here, all of these, we can take without a problem. We just have to be able to carry them all. That's the only issue. Oh, big leg. Okay, one last deposit. Oh, yeah, this is going good, folks. Real good. Right, got anything else going there? Oh, come on. Look at that. And put that in there. Close her up. Just do that to get rid of the duffel bag. Put the bag in the bag. Very nice. We're out of here. We definitely have to come back, though. Or I can... You know, I was going to say I was going to do it off camera, but no. We are going to go get a truck before we come back here. If I forget, please remind me, but we need to find a big truck with lots of space so that we can actually do things. Like that. Like moving all those crates and lockers out. And the display cases while I'm at it as well. We just need to find one. That's the only issue. But we are making good time right now. What, we've been, I've been recording, recording for what, 27-ish minutes? I think, yeah, that's right. Maybe a little bit more, a little bit less, but that's a, that's approximate. Yeah, that was a lot of good stuff. I just was not expecting that much, but I am playing on different settings, so all is well. Well, that gloriousness on the floor right there. Let's get this in here. Looks like the garden is coming along well. It did rain for like two days, off and on. So, it is doing very nice. Okay, turn off the engine. Do a little bit of that. I see it. And let me not dump out the good stuff that we need to keep in here. Like so. Bam. Do a little bit of... Th uh, that can stay. Sledgehammer stays. This is my expedition vehicle right now. Molotovs and bombs stay. All the guns can go, though. Is that all? Yeah. Oh, wait. No. I saw a mistake. Right there. That stays. Just look at all that. Are we good? We're good. Yeah. Okay. Let me go park this inside. All right. Parked up. I still have a lot of stuff here as well. I've been going on looting sprees in my spare time with... Actually, this might be from the last episode. I don't really remember. Could have been. But either way, I've been looting up. But it's time to add to the pile. This is the kill zone special. If you've been around, you know it. I just kind of dump stuff at the end of each episode. I didn't start with before you even know it. I'll put that on the secondary. Come on, Keith. You got it. I wonder, is this, this level up strength? I would think it would, right? Since we're putting strain on our on our back with all this weight. That would make sense, right? I'll turn on the generator in a second once I get everything in here. Let's see. We've still got a lot out here. Alright, I will see you guys when this is all on the floor. Alrighty, guys. Everything is on the floor. Before I show you that... Let's get this generator running. Turn on. Bam. Let's see what awaits. Look at that. That is perfect. Puts a smile on my face. I see light in here once again. I can finally run around in the nighttime with lights on. Because if once once night hits, this place is pitch black. Like I cannot see a thing. But now, actually, let me go. Let me show you guys what I've done to my to Keith's bedroom. I've been working on it. I need to go get the other TV for that. But I got some friends here. I've been putting the outfits on them for Keith. He can talk to them. All right, come on, Keith. Give him a wave. There you go. Kind of interrupted it, but that's fine. 
But yeah, I got my, got my clothing, got books, got antique oven. I don't know if we we'll ever need that. I don't know if it gets that gold, but we've got it. But uh, yeah, so let me stop running into a pillar. Let me get down here. Check out our stats once more. What are we rocking? 79 weight. It has flatlined. Favorite weapon is still the crowbar. You've killed 1,375 Zeds. You have survived for one month, five days, almost six days. Very nice. What is it, guys? Kills in here, and welcome back to the Nox Road Trip. We are here at the base in good old Keith's little old bedroom here. Not little, it's kind of big. It is currently snowing outside. It is now March the 2nd. Keith has survived for one month, nine days, 12 hours. Going on 1,400 Zeds killed. And before I tell you what we're doing today, let's just take a look out here. I've been preparing this for the next stream. I do like doing my building on stream because it gives you guys a chance to input on my decisions and to help me figure out how to build bases. I've never built an actual base before, like with decorations and all that. I usually just do it for survival, but as you can see, I've started a brick wall here with door frames. That's going to go all the way along here so that I can separate my garage here from the main base and then we're gonna put floors above so that we have a ceiling for the bedroom we can put stuff on the second floor it's gonna be so nice when it's done but uh yeah today we are gonna go someone's screaming out someone just died but <laughs> yeah we are gonna go out to the double the double decker bus first of all and then we're gonna go scout out the main road to the big old hospital here i want to see what's going on over there and then hopefully we make it out of there, and we go back down here. I want to see what this industrial building is. It might be another warehouse. I do need more generators. We also need to level up electrical for solar panels. And yeah, I'm going to get the, the Jeep ready. And I'll see you guys out on the road. Alrighty, we are coming up on the Double Dugger bus. Ooh, that's a good looking trailer there. Hello. Alrighty. I also took a look at my aiming skill and saw that we are close to level 4 aiming. So, we're going to let this shotgun ring for a bit. We have quite a bit of ammo to use. And it's suppressed. This shotgun is pump action. Wait a minute. Did they change it? This wasn't... Am I going crazy? Someone, please, go back to... Go back to one of my other videos and see if this M500 shotgun was pump action before. Because I'm pretty sure that it wasn't. I am, I don't even know. Keith, what did you do to my shotgun? Oh yeah, this is all clogged up. Okay, let's, let's just get up here and see what's going on. We'll be back for you, bus. I want to see what I can do with you. What have we got? Oh yeah, it's bad out here. Hopefully my, my, my right click doesn't get me killed. How much ammo are we rocking? Okay, not much. We've got, yeah, 23, 22 now. Let's get the hammer back out. Alright, what's going on? Oh, lag. There's the main parking lot, I think. Hello, you. Get on the ground. Get funky. Goodbye. Little ambulance there. Not much else. I might have to go get old Shoelace Express to go check out the hospital. I don't want to get the Jeep stuck in here. But for now, let's check out this good old thing here. Just make sure I'm clear. Okay, there's one up there. I want to check out that trailer as well, but let's see. Locked. Not a problem. Oh, right here. I think it was blended in. With the darkness of that, uh, that van there. Was it covered in deep red blood and things? Let's go. Nothing to read. Anxious. Just smoke. What are you doing? That was working before. Maybe I have to go change something. Maybe I messed it up. Okay, back to this. Come on, Keith. Keith. There you go. Thank you. I'm like that. I'm like that. We should be able to enter, right? Yeah, let's see. Good lord. That was loud. Looking good, though. That seems to be the, yeah, the driver's seat. I don't believe Zeds can spawn inside the vehicles, but I'm also not going to take my chances. Okay, nice. We're in. This is very cool. You, know, you would need a sledgehammer to dis disassemble these. That's a tongue twister sometimes. 
but we don't actually get claustrophobia in here. It is big enough. This could be something. If we can get it repaired. Very cool. The lights work? The lights work. I'm guessing that's tied to the battery. How do I leave? Exit. Right there. Big leg. That makes sense. Oy. Let's see. What's in the glove? Nothing. Lights are on. Turn those off. First eye. Nice. Okay, let's take a look at the mechanics. In the back. This thing is good. Oh, we might have to take this back. Okay. That thing is ready to go. Uh, let me go hotwire it. I did not expect that. Oh, it is hotwired yet. I already forgot. I am experiencing Alzheimer's. Where's the trunk? Is it in the front? I guess now it's a frunk. Yep. 130. Not bad at all. Alright, let's go check out this trailer. This looks like a... Yeah, you can probably sleep in one of them trailers. One of those... It's one of those trailers. I don't know what I'm trying to say. You understand, hopefully. 10 a.m. Hammer's starting to take some damage. Hello, sir. Come on out. Pop. Boom. And pow. Oh. Wait, well, that was a four swinger. That was going to be a three. They're coming out of this building. Where are you going? I see you down there. We got some inside munching. I hear them. This van ain't looking too bad either. Oh, you're a firefighter. How'd you get down here? You're supposed to be at the station. I do believe this wind chill is making Keith swing slower. Bonk. Man, not much on y'all. Put those on the floor. Oh, okay. A little warehouse thing. What are they making in there? Come on out, sir. Oh, well, you're a cop. Hold on. I see that duty belt. Yep. You know, Meade County Sheriff's Office. Oh, yeah. This is something else. Where are we? Is this the building I wanted to check out? No, this is a totally different one right here. All right, looks like... Actually, hold on. I gotta decide what I want to do first. Let's check out this trailer. I think that we can agree on. Where is the entrance? There it is. Wow. Why does it have a key? I'm not gonna do that. Look at this. Big leg. Oy. There we go. There's stuff in here. Okay, yeah, we can't sleep in here. Carpentry 2. We never got Carpentry 2. Okay, I'm taking that. Just for the collection. Got water. Fill up. Nice. Nice little bed. It's very small, but it powers out. This could be good for storage. Put a lot of... Uh, how tall is this? With two? I think two tiles high. That could be nice. Having crates in all the walls. Come on. That's a camper van. That's a or camper trailer. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Okay, get out, Keith. You're gonna get way too freaked out. Those small spaces. Get some down there. Okay. Let's go check out the hospital for a quick second. I just want to take a peek at it. What's up? Hello, you. Don't think I don't see you. Almost got the double. Wait, wait, this is the shotgun was pump action before, I think. So which one is the semi-automatic? Did I switch it out? I don't know. How are we looking? Make sure we're clear on the road. I see you munching. Little resistance so far. That's very nice. Bunk. Is 
Let's take a little look, see. Cool little vanity, a little little thing there. Saint Peregrine Hospital. Oh, here we go. Oh. Hey bro. I heard you. Die, Mr. Mohawk. Jeez. Twenty six degrees out. It's a bit chilly. Hopefully it gets warmer. Get a nice little double kill here if I can. Nope. There is enemy level 4. Very nice. Good job, Keith. What else we got? I used to the roads down here. are actually very clear. Maybe too far. I mean, yeah, I've not seen much of a of a fight down here. Kind of surprised, really. I hear some more. Oh, hey. Bye bye. Shotgun starting to lose his condition as well. Go back to the hammer. We still okay. No aiming is. Good now. Okay, nice. We do need electrical three. I know that. How is this looking? I can't see. Keith, please. Focus your eyes. Oh, never mind. That lag means there's a bunch of zeds in there. Time to leave. Okay, that's enough of that. We'll definitely come back here when we're ready to fight. But for now, let's go check out that uh, that warehouse. Alrighty, back at the warehouse. Let's see. Anything in here? Ooh, ham radio. Maybe we can make a ham radio now. Nice. Uh, I'll take the high-end camera as well. Actually, I can just dismantle all that. What about this? I can. Oh, hey, 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 hey. I hear you. Ah, uh, crap. Okay, put those away. Never mind, don't have time. I'm fighting with the screwdriver. No, no, no. Please take out the screwdriver. Oh no, just take out the hammer, I mean. You, you were all over the place. Thank you. Okay. Oh, there's more. Thank you. Look at you, little bandit woman. Nice little leather jacket. Too bad it has a giant hole in the back. Take the aviators, though. Actually, I'll take all that. Uh, anything else for my mannequin friends? No. Okay, I don't need those videos. Put those away. Okay, let me dismantle this. Nice. Chop. Take. There we go. Okay, um, let me think. I'm thinking we can see what's going on over here. I think that's a garage door. Yep. There's two. Let's see if we can get through here. I'm sorry if I sound sick. It's because I am. My allergies got to me. Alright, pry door. Actually, let me see if it's open. Nope. Okay. Anyone home? I hope not. Someone's home. You're months in a way. Is this an electronics store? Or is this an electronics building? It's looking like it. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Scanner? I don't even know what that's for. Asphalt batteries. I'll take all the batteries I can get. There we go. Got some red lights we can, or light bulbs we can use for our lights if you want to. Don't know what the scanner modules are for. But we've got them if we need them. Alright. Of course you're locked. Come on, Keith. Strong man, where you at? Thank you. Oh my. I don't like the noise I'm hearing. More scanner modules. I don't know what those are. Pop a beta blocker before we run into somebody. There's a corpse here. Let's 
scrap wood. Jeez, you guys are going at it. I can't unlock it from this side. Alright, go for it. Finally, some peace and quiet. Running out of shells, though. I got more in the trunk, but... I don't want to run out while I'm here. Coveralls, flashlights, some boots. Destroy this. Thank you. Put that away. Hmm. Nothing much down here, it seems. Looks like that, that back room was... Where most of the things are. Ooh, that's nice, though. Nothing else. Okay. Upstairs. Ooh, actually, there's radios here. Give me one moment. There's another one. Come on over. Kind of worried I was going to miss on that first head that came through, but we're good. These should all be... Pretty nice. I'll take the ham radio. I don't need the rest of them. That's gonna make me overweight. Okay, dismantle these now. That's a weird way to dismantle a radio, Keith. There you go. That's the proper way to do it. And then we put this stuff in the trunk. And we deal with the rest as we go. Let me see, I just, need, I just need to do this real quick. Bam. Bam. And bam. Go, 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 go before I die. Down here. Ah, crap. Hello, guys. Good to see you. Time to die. More firefighters there, it seems, in the parking lot. Okay, put this away. All of it. Thank you. Cool. Back inside. See what's going on on the second floor. Get the Kobe out. Right up here. Pop a blocker. Got the computer. Let's see. Very nice. Uh, how does electrical do? Yeah, I'm not gonna even try. I'm gonna wait for my book. I need to find the electrical book. This, though, I will take a peek. It's all run. I mean, I could take it for compost. But that's... I already have enough. I have enough of that. Coloring book? That's nice. Kitchen kilns already did that. I don't remember doing it, but I did. Okay, yeah, we're good here. On to our final destination of the day. I forgot this place was a big old self-storage facility. I really did. But we're here now, so... Might as well get it over with. We've got some company. They're trying to get their way out. I see that one. Let's see what you first. Nice hair, man. You bet you die. I do like your apron, though. Is there a hole in it? Can I have it? Pizza World? Ooh, no. I will take that. That's a perfectly good Pizza World apron. And we're starting to break a bit more. Hello there. You've got a pistol for me. If you don't mind, Sheriff, I would, I would like to have that for my collection. Thank you. M10-5. Okay, get that there. Dismantle this. Bam, bam. Boom. Now the jelly belt on the floor, just in case I want him. Let's see. What are we dealing with? Big old building down there. Alright, let's deal with these guys. Ooh, hey. What's going on right here? They're breaking out of all the things. Um, there's probably going to be a generator or two in here. You know what? 
me let me go grab some shotgun shells. Let's have some fun. I think Keith deserves it, and he needs to level up his aiming anyway. Or he already did that. All right, well, we're doing it just for fun then. Open them up. 120. Perfect. Let her rip. Keith deserves it. He has survived. How long now? That's the wrong one. Is it G? Yeah. One month, nine days, 17 hours. He's been through hell and back. And it's only gonna get worse. Kinda weird not having the music play. I know it's on this time. I did not forget it. There it is. I built it into existence. Nice. Oh, you're coming after me? Nope, you're not. You die anyway. Alright, let's get through here. Do what you first. Where you at? I know you're back here. That's creepy. Can't see him. Bye bye. What, jams? I'm oh, already. I should be able to reload it. On jam. Something wrong with that. I don't know what happened there. There we go. Looks like they tried to board this place off. It might have worked. I'm actually not sure. There's a diner back here. Nope, they're in. Never mind. The boards did not work. That is a lot. I hope we can get the key. I don't want to pry open every single door. Okay, that's you making noise, okay? Scared me a bit. What's in here? Fishing nets, nice. Box of nails? An actual nail gun? Extinguisher? We actually might want to keep one of them, just in case a generator blows up. There is a generator! I am willing stuff into existence. Okay, nice, we gotta come back to that. I just want a key. Can I get a key? And Keith is not gonna like any of this. He's gonna be panicked anytime he's in this building. Got some posters on the wall I can take. Got a Marlboro poster? Little guy with a white cowboy hat. Yeah, I'm hearing a lot of a lot of deadheads around here. Room by room. Clear them all. Swept sweep your corners. And we'll be fine. Hunting knife. Cool. Where are you? Okay, I see you. You're in here. You better get some buckshot straight to the face. Oh, stop turning. I told you. Buckshot to the face. They seem to be getting a little bit more angry. Alright, door number two. It's starting to rain now. Nice, it got warmer. More fishing stuff. Well, if you ever want to fish, we can do it. Looking for moving doors. These two, right here. Hello, Sheriff. Door at a time. One door at a time. One shotgun shell at a time. These two doors now. I'm glad they're only single fall on these doors. There's another Jenny. Nice. Let's go check down here. Any more banging? I hear you. What door are you on? I got one of these. That one right there. Nice. Another Jenny. We got three. Very nice. Okay, this is gonna be a whole lot of looting. Hey, I'm gonna have to come back for this. That is a lot. I do want to keep a Jenny for now, though. You will take a Jenny. Uh, well, that one's busted. Hold on. This one any good? Right here. Right there. Yeah, that one's perfect. Nice. 
take this one. Put it in my bag so I can have a weapon. Oh, can I not do that anymore? No, okay. Shucks. Hmm. Yeah, I can't do that. Okay, I'm gonna have to make sure I'm safe. I can't vault any of the fences either while I'm carrying this. Which makes sense. That's physics. Should be still good, right? Cool truck. I do like that truck. It isn't blue, though. It's like an off purple. Come on, Keith. Strong man. You can do it. Put it away. Please. Come on, Keith. There we go. Keith, we're out of space. Okay, put it in the in the tr in the actual seat. You're right. That'll work. Okay, good. Nice. That's a cool little day's worth of exploration. I'm gonna get this G pack home and then let's go get that bus. Ah, uh, crap. That's not good. Oh, yeah, the grass guy clacked as well. Okay. We might not be using this just Jeep for a little while longer. Alrighty. I walked Keith all the way back down so we can get this bus off the road and into our base. Probably just gonna park it outside. I don't know if I want this inside. I don't know if it'll fit, actually. I don't know if that second story counts as an actual second story. Come on, bus. Yeah, okay. I ran over somebody. I could not see you. I can let me not crash this like it just did to the Jeep. Turning this thing is gonna be a pain. There we go. A little army surplus ad on the side. That's very cool. Went there in the last episode. Okay. Should be smooth sailing back up here. I will see you guys back home. Already back home. With the big old bus. Looks like our crops are doing very well. We'll check on those before the episode's over. Let's see. I want to point this out here, maybe. Maybe not on the grass, but just on this side. That Jeep took a beating on that light post. It'll we'll stop doing that. But it's hard. I can't see past the building sometimes. This is nice right here. Perfect. It's like it was meant to be. Nice. Okay. Uh, let me get the jeep back inside so I can unload off camera. Get that all sorted. Just back this baby up right quick. If it'll start up again. Oh, there we go. It seems like the it was the trunk and the the front windshield that took the impact. So that's nice. Was there anything I can't replace? But we do have to start doing mechanics. Very important that we do that. All right, let's go check on the crops, and then we'll call this an episode. Let's see. I've harvested the lemongrass, I think, once or twice now. Yeah, because you can harvest them very quickly. The two of these are already seed-bearing again. And they they just keep going back. I don't have to replant them. Kind of weird. But I'll take it. And these lettuce are seed-bearing now? Nice. Boom. Okay, Keith, you are dying. 52 lettuce. Very nice. Uh, I gotta go here. Anything else? Yeah, we have cabbage growing as well. I think that's it for crops right now. Let's see. How's the wheat doing? Yeah, that's still young. Tea? Young. Broccoli, young. Potatoes, young. Radishes. Strawberry. And then this is lettuce. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Let's go ahead downstairs. Show y'all what I'm doing to the kitchen. I am trying to renovate it a little bit. It'll also be something we do on stream. Hopefully. If I get to record or stream next weekend. Get the lights on. As you can see, I've removed all of the benches. So I put on actual shelves so we can store more things. Let's see. I gotta put this away. Boom. Look at that. Almost one full freezer full of all this stuff. Nice. What is up guys, Gilson here, and welcome back to the Nox Road Trip. As you can see, 
Keith has uh, a new hairdo. His hair finally grew out. So let's take a look at how he's doing. Weight is going up. I ate like a whole thing of cereal right before this. But uh, yeah, his hair is now Fabian now. I'm pretty sure if we can tie it or cut it. I think I'm going to tie it for this episode. So let's just do that now. Hmm. I wish I could see it from different angles. I think we're going to go up for... Hair bun, no fringe. Let's see. Oh, can't do it while sitting. Oh, there you go, Keith. Look at you. Yeah, that's nice. Might have to do something about the beard, or maybe not. Let me know down. Let me know down in the comments. But uh, yeah, let's see the rest of his stats. Where is his survival time? It's gone. What? Well, yeah, either way, he is still has the favorite weapon as the crowbar. Zombies killed is 1,496. 1, I am all over the place today. Why is his time survive gone? There it is. Survived for one month, 11 days, 10 hours. So let me show you what I've got going on here. I finished up the garage wall off camera because I was a little bit bored. I'm being, oh, sorry, I hit the mic. I don't know if you heard that, but yeah, I got a little bit bored. So I did that. Wasn't, wasn't anything special. Just kind of did it. But I did. We actually turn on the lights. Turn off the lights. Let me go. Go out here. Show you what else I got. Of course, we got the double decker bus in the last episode, but I also got the trailer here now, so we can really start working on the the road trip side of this series once we get everything set up. Uh, let's see, how is this? Oh, there's a problem with the crops. Hold on, hold on, there, partner. We can't be having that. Usually, I don't really worry about the crop sicknesses because they don't really do much. Let me just see. Can I harvest anything? My uh, cabbages came in. I've been harvesting my lemongrass as well. And my lettuce. Lettuce came in as well. Got a solar panel up here ready for when I can actually do it. Can't do it now. Don't have the skill for that yet. But uh, yeah, let's take a look at the map real quick. And I'll show you what we're doing today. We are going to go explore more of this area. Maybe that garage and that, that uh, gas station as well. But for now. We're going to go see what this is. I don't know what this is. It's a weird looking building. It is. It says it's residential. So there might be a bit of killing going on there. But yeah, probably won't go into the residential just yet. I have a poll up on the channel in the community tab. So please go look at that. Vote if you please. But so yeah, that is for another episode. Uh, maybe we can check out that restaurant. Some more of the overall shopping strip mall thing going on there. I don't know what that is. And then we've got an auto shop there, some type of medical place there, and then something big down here for residential. So overall, we've got a lot to do. But uh, yeah, I'm going to get geared up, get Keith ready to rock, and I'll see you down there. Already, we went into the first destination of the day. There's like a big old apartment, apartment complex. I really am off my game today with my words. Oh, I'm going to leave the van running because the battery is kind of iffy. So I'd rather it charge here than die when I'm trying to start it back up. Yeah, an officer up there. I think I saw a knife in you, ma'am. Some type of blade in your leg there. That's not very healthy. That's a file. Never mind. I don't need that. There's a house alarm going off. In the residential area. Hmm. This is actually the first whole house alarm. Hmm. Am I wrong? Can't remember. Might have been one at the start of the series. Not sure. Bunk. A little map. And also, as you saw in the intro, I did put the shotgun. Actually, that's a different shotgun. I or I redid my shotgun build into a different one that holds more. I think it holds seven shots now instead of five. But I decided to get Keith a good old G17 now because he's got some aiming skill now and he can actually use it. We've got some time before they turn into fast chamber, so we can be a little bit more lenient with what we do. Don't know where y'all are coming from. You have a fancy, trippy, I don't even know, fit on. What were you doing out here? Is there a party going on somewhere? Another man with a knife in his back. I see you, sir. I don't like all these trees, but it must be done. It's just a letter opener. Alright. Alright, alright. 
Hey, get away from my van. I don't appreciate you being in my van. Also. Okay, I thought Keith is brave because he hasn't he hasn't panicked yet, but he will be brave. I think before the five thousand kill mark, I think. It's either that or he'll, or he'll just go straight to desensitize. But there is a food market here. Ooh, I see what they're what they're doing. They got they got shops on the first floor and then apartments. You can live. Not not in a in an actual complex like this, but I I do know them. I see a person with some goodies. You're making a lot of pitter patter with your feet there, ma'am. You've got some guns for me. There you go, Keith. Yeah, we got a lot of valuables that could be in there. M590, nice. Put that on the floor. Alright, let's see what's going on down here. What is this? Is this the... Hold on. Take a look at the map. Where am I? Okay, that's just that. This is just... What is this? It's like a warehouse. Please, let me be wrong. Just as a, a big diner? Absolutely. Wow. Okay, well, if I know anything from Tanner's experience and 10 years later, it's probably going to be a lot of Zeds coming down those stairs. So I got to be careful with that. Yeah, today is just a, basically a continuation of exploring Levenberg. That's really what I want to do. Just walk around, see what's going on, maybe shoot a couple Zeds, who knows. There's the strip mall thing. Shopping street thing. I don't know what to call it. Another cup up there with a bag I want. Bonk for you two, you are a biker. Come back for you later. Another colorful tie, man. Can I take that? I can, that's a cool tie. I'll take it. Baton, shotgun, very nice. Ba -ba -ba. Boom, boom. No, I'm gonna stop putting the belts on the ground. There's already a lot of them. I don't even think I'm gonna need them all for my mannequin friends, but we'll take all this. Let's see. Pistola. Leather jacket's brokey. We're not going to take that, but we will take the bandanas. You can always use more bandanas. Hmm. Tell you what, let's go in here. Get the pistol out. I want no surprises, Keith. Is door unlocked? Yep. I have to have escape routes in places like this. Because you never know. Sounds like they're munching upstairs. This looks all clear. There's a lot of carpentry leveling to be had in here. Let's go check the kitchen. This place kind of looks unfinished as well. But that could also just be the aesthetic of, of the building. Turn on proxy. What have we got? We've got some beer, brother. Let's take it. Love the ice cream, of course. Rotten corn dog. Da -da -da -da. I don't know if I said it already, but I did take a look at the weather channel. We have a thunderstorm coming in in, I think, four days from now. So we gotta be careful about that. Don't want to be caught up in that. Especially when we go out on our killing sprees with the, the hospital and things. Depends on where we go. I'm also not sure if I want to burn down the hospital or not. I might do it just because that'll be cool. I haven't used fire in a long time. At least feels in like a long time. I'm taking a lot of beer. This is a beer raid now. This is a beer episode. Here we go. All the alcohol. I have all these bottles is good as well. I could just empty them all out for water. Or I can give Keith a little bit of a party. Actually, I should be prioritizing the bourbon. I'll drop all that. I'm being a stoop. Just get the bourbon, Keith. Top notch bourbon. I kind of forgot how to play Zomboy for a second. It's been a while. Some shiggy nice peanuts. What else you got? Smoke bomb under the counter. Nice. More ice freezers. 
Little bourbon. Very nice. Let's unlock this door. Another escape route. Alright, let's go upstairs. This is exactly how Tanner died, by the way. Right there. I think his name is Tanner. I forgot. It's been a while. Got stuck behind a bar just like that. And the yell came rushing down the stairs. Was it Tanner? Tanner Miller? That sounds right. I don't like this. And the music kicked in the R up here. I dropped one. Okay, that's a new, new tip. Just a blind fire, if not sure. Oh, this is cool, though. Sounds like we're clear enough for now. Get some more peanuts. Little, little snack for the road. There you go, Keith. Ooh, chips. Yes. All these snacks are really real useful. There's the key to the place. There we go. Ooh, bourbon and chips. Perfect. Exactly what I need. Okay, let's give the MAGA reload. Top off a bit. Put that back in the vest. What else we got? Some more bourbon. Very nice. Olives, that's... Yeah, that's a mod. Very cool. You can always use more lighters. But we are stocked up on bourbon. I'll tell you what. Molotov galore. 17. We can burn down this city and then some. Let's see what's, what's over here. What is this? Why is it blocked off? Is this going to be a secret? I just dismantle it. No, I need to metal work that. Okay, give me one minute. There we go. What is this? What am I about to see here? What is Keith about to run into? Why was this blocked off? Is that intentional? I don't know. Seems to be just a regular old little little place to stay for the night type thing. Kind of weird those there's benches, but yeah, they're all the same. Turn that back on. Put that down your hatch. So I can stop listening to your heart beating, Keith. Kind of annoying. And yeah, they all just have books, it seems. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not even gonna bother. If I miss something, I miss something, but that just seems to be copy-pasted, each one. Which is totally fine, that is how map design works sometimes. But either way, this is a very nice place. You can mark this off the map. I've also been experimenting with outlining certain buildings, as you can see. Even, yeah, the hospital. Okay. Bam. Boom. Okay, let's go back to this, this big old, big old complex. Does have garages. There could be some good stuff in there. There's also a, just a ton of floors. Get the hammer out for you. Hey, it is nine o'clock. Okay, yeah, we've got to go put some stuff away. I've gotta ignore that. We have a smoke on the way back. Nothing to see here. Just a man carrying how much? Eighteen bottles of bourbon in his backpack, and a smoke bombs and pickles, peanuts, some two shotguns, two pistols. You know, just normal stuff. Should be just up here now. I did leave the engine running. Okay. I'll check on the battery as well. Gotta make sure this van keeps you running. Otherwise, we might be stranded out here. I can always run back to base, but you get the idea. Very nice. Actually, I can move up the van as well. We've got plenty of gas, so I'll just I'll leave it running right here at the corner. Shouldn't be too many Zeds around, I don't think. Except for the ones in here, of course. What have we got? Come on, Keith. Nice shot. Good aim. Ooh. 
barbecue sauce. I didn't even realize that. Give me that. I love me some good barbecue. That's a macaron. Carbitrate. We already got that. I should stop looting. That's a lot of canned stuff. Okay, yeah, we'll be back. We'll be back. Stop banging on that door, man. Good night. Oh, we got rotten sacks of stuff. That's fine. Oh, yeah, this is real nice. Is that a key? Yes. Bam. Got some juice boxes, fire extinguishers. Very nice. No new books. I am looking for new books. I've read through all of them. Except for foraging level one, I believe. Man, this is just very nice. Even though most of the stuff is rotten. There's still a lot of good stuff ready for the picking. So let's mark that on the map real quick. Where's my apple? Apple, apple, a hey, apple, where are you at? Apple, there you go. Put that in green. Is there still loot available? What is this, uh, Pizza World, I think? Yep. I knew a pizza world when I see one. Here are some books. Thank you. And they're magazines, but... Yeah, that's leg pouches and... Scrap armor. You can definitely look into that. There's another one. Oh, that's the same one. Never mind. I should be looking... I know how to use that mod for litter, but I'm just kind of ignoring it right now. Because when you pick up a book, the yellow thing in the corner goes off. And so you know not to pick it up again, but I just gotta ignore that. Scared? What are you saying? I wasn't scared. I'm totally fine. Let's just take a beta blocker real quick. Alright. Keep on chugging on. Crate of tea? Okay, there's a, there's a lot to do here. Stairs. Dead Zeds. Looks like, we're, looks like we're going in. Take a quick reload. Pack the mag back up. We haven't got much ammo on us. Yeah, we're already burning through a lot of it. So let's actually switch over to the good old hammer. See what's going on. Big old parking space. Very nice. This place isn't a bad base either. Dear God, let's get out of here. It looks like we're going to need that pistol again. Alright, Keith. Time to get to work. Oh, you got back up. How are we looking? He seems to have a hard time hitting them when they're down. So I'm going to try to refrain from doing that then. Swapping mag. There we go. I like these three. Probably gonna miss a ton of shots trying to hit them. Someone's phone and something's going off alarm clock. Your hat interests me. You're a cop, that's why. Police trooper hat. I'm gonna take it. It's blue. That could be a good fit. Drink eating to a cop. Who knows? Another man finally getting up. Too bad your vest is broken. I would have taken that as well. Nice blue. Yeah, that's that's gone. That is reduced to atoms. Nice posters and that's a they're just cherries on a poster. That's cool. Oh, there's a door. I was wondering where you were. Gunsmith, pipe branch. Rolling rods. Nothing much. Okay, that's clear. Tell you what. Hmm. I think we might just stay here for the time being. Clear it out. See what's going on. It's been pretty eventful so far. So let's see. Let's head upstairs. Have the good old pistol out. It seems to be pretty quiet so far. So this might be might be quicker than I thought to get through here. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Let's go to... I don't... Do I... 
I mean, it says I don't. It says I have it, but I don't think I have it. Have it. I might have left that back at the lodge. Or I'm just stupid and I'm blind. They got campfires here too. Fry your places, I should say. Yeah, this would definitely make a good spot to base up. Knock knock, who is it? It's me. I should say it's Keith. Take the belt. Where's this alarm? Tech 9, thank you. Stop it. Shut up, alarm. Please drop it. Claustrophobia's kicking back in. That's fine. No Zeds around right now, I don't think. The red room. Yeah, this this city, overall. A solid 10 out of 10. I don't know if I'm much of a judge, but I love this city. I love Levenberg. Very nice. Might be my favorite map so far. Who knows? Could be. Maybe. Probably. There's also just a lot to do here. I think I might just call this quits here. There is a lot, lot to loot. And I don't want to take this whole episode. Maybe we can, we can come back here on, on stream. That could be good. Chill out, talk, loot every single one of these rooms, and then try to get on with our lives. Oh yeah, let's just get out of here. Because I want to explore. Alright, we can repack a mag over here. Very nice. Repack this one. Lighter. Is that my lighter? No. That's from, that's from earlier. I remember now. Clock mag. Put it away. Dump all this. There we go. Nice. Keith, I rather... You look rather bald from, like, from this angle, but it's just... It's just the hair looks weird. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Alrighty, let's see. Oh, wrong one. Gotta do this first. There we go. Where are we? Let me take a look. I think we'll go down to the auto shop to round off the episode right here. That could be good. We do need parts. I do want to start kitting out some of these vehicles. And maybe we find a truck down here. Like, a, like an actual like moving truck or something. Okay, I will turn off the engine here though. Because we are getting into residential areas. I don't want to make too much noise. I want to make just the right amount of noise. The right amount of noise. I was... Hard for me to say. There are no vehicles out here. Hmm. Another house alarm going off. And I think maybe that dude in the front sees me. There's people inside. This place wouldn't be a bad base either. Just That's how you know you've made a good city. Is when every single building you come across can make a good base. Like, it's it's phenomenal. Come on out. I saw you. Like, honestly. How are we looking? Are we good? Oh, we're not good. Come on, then. What the... Hey, what's up? What's up? What is it, ma'am? I'm gonna take that out of you. Just like a Mad Max candy game. Yeah, come on. Kinda sketchy. Hold on. There you go. Just die. Adios. A salvage crowbar. It's not blues, but it could go with a different fit, maybe, perhaps. Hello, you. Or you too, I should say. Bunk. And bunk. Bunk. And bunk. I am a Dark Souls strength build. Firefighter? What are you doing here? Where's your uh, fire truck at? I wonder if I just killed Lenny. See right there? Lenny's car repair? That guy could be Lenny. We might have to <laughs> bury him later. Da -da -da. Hmm. West Point map. Don't need. We've got some visitors, folks. You open this door. Can't. Unlock it. 
Where the hell are y'all coming from? That's a way. Did y'all just suddenly radiate to my position? You've got a sickle on your back. Let me pop a beta blocker. Get out this pistol. Hey, you stay away from my van. I don't appreciate that. I'm also, yeah, I'm drawing the attention to the whole neighborhood. Or the whole block. Clock putting in the work. Very nice. Ooh, hey. My mouse is messing up. I need to put more batteries in it or newer ones. Or just better ones, maybe. I don't know. I am looking about getting a new mouse, though. There we go. And fork. Hello, kitten. Watch. I'm taking that. Very nice. That's a collectible item. Take the scythe. Well, I'm never going to use it, but maybe. Maybe Keith can become the Grim Reaper of Knox County. Killing the dead. That was it. I'm out of bullets. I am. Hmm. Alright. You. Stop it. Being rude. You laughed about it. Yeah, you definitely deserve to die. He was a psychopath before he turned, and he was a psychopath after he turned. Car battery charger, yes! Roof lights. I don't really think I need any of that, but that car battery charger? Oh, yeah. How's that work, actually? Never used one. Place on the ground, they use the contacts menu to attach a battery. Oh. Cool. Engine parts. Very nice. Another jump starter. I needed one of them. You've got that. Yeah, we definitely have to get a a Humvee ready to go at some point. That'll be our main vehicle probably for sometime after. What am I saying? Sometime throughout the series. Humvee is a good, reliable vehicle. Regular heavy duty. That's nice. Jack. Tire pumps. Or zombies outside trying to ruin my day. Got a back storage room right here. Let me close this door. Unlock this. What's back here? So many things. So many things. Bunch of tires. Oh, yeah. We're coming back here. If we ever need to repair, we definitely find the parts here. What else we got? Let me open this. Just to make sure it's unlocked. Bathroom? Nope. Changing room. Of course, of course. Some more crossbows I will take. Always make her? Actually, that's a smart... Ooh. Is that better? No. It's cool back, though. But yeah, that is a smart idea. I can use my noisemakers to... When we go on big killing sprees, just get them out into the open. Can of oats. I haven't seen those in a while. More tea bags. Take a soda. Nice. We got a little reception area. Take some of this. Take that out of pipe too. That could be useful. Some more shiggies, please. Thank you. Alright, that looks to be about it for this. Need the wind going through the door there. Mark this off. I forgot to outline that, but that's fine. Alright. Well, I think I'm gonna head back home. And I will see you guys there. Hey, yo, what happened over here? I'm just trying to get back home, and this is what I come back to? Come on, Keith. I know it's not your fault, but still. I get the pistol out. Can't be having this. I'm gonna start burning these corpses. Because they keep on attracting more. Okay, that had one bullet, Keith. What what happened there? Do I need these have bullets? There you go. I will take that pipe off your hand, sir. Give me that. Long metal pipe. Saw that down. Get two metal pipes out of it, I think. Maybe just one regular pipe, but I can still use it. 
But seriously, they're just why are they here? Did a helicopter or something come through? Maybe it was the junk, the junkards that came in. Maybe it was them. They came back for more. Bought a few Z heads over here. Try to get me killed. Try to get Keith killed. Despicable. Can't be having that. Alright, let's get this back in here. And probably go up to the garden. So I can see you guys off. Don't hit the wall. Okay. Cool. Well, that was a good productive day. Got a lot of stuff in that trunk there. I'll tell you what, I even found another shotgun on the way back home. Out on another cop by the prison garage doors. Right next to home. What is up guys, Kills in here and welcome back to the Noxo trip. So, I have something to tell y'all. You see that pile of blood next to Keith here? That's his blood. If you caught the stream last Saturday, you would have saw that, um, Keith got bit. So we had to chop his arm off, but as you can see, his arm is in mint condition because the mod, the only cure, that's what it's called, that lets you chop off your arms. It was giving me like thousands of errors. It was making my game lag. I, I tried not removing it so because that would be cool to see Keith with a prosthetic arm. That would be epic. He'd be super cool. But it just didn't work out in the end. I had to get rid of it. I'm sorry. But to secure the future of the series, I had to do it. But today, we are going to go start our little killing spree at the hospital. St. Peregrine's Hospital. I have geared up a bit. I'll show you that. Before we head out, I still got to get this blood off the floor. I got to find like a mop and some bleach. We found this M16 in that stream as well. We only have one mag, but we've got like four boxes of 556, so we can we can let this ring a bit. I've got the katana ready to go. We are gonna go chop up some Zeds. Let me get Keith back looking good. There we go. Alright, let me show you what I've got going on out here. I actually have to turn off the lights as well. Let me do that. Don't want to be wasting power before we head off. The garden is looking good. I harvested some crops right before this. The corn is almost ready to go. I'm just waiting on it to be seed bearing so that I have a surplus. And the wheat is still growing. As you can see now. Corn is looking nice. And yeah, just overall, very good. We've got water, we've got everything. So yeah, I've got the trailer set up with the van. If we hop on the trunk real quick, you'll see. I've got two bags filled with a bunch of stuff that I could use. Got the rest of the the regular stuff I had in there, like two box, gas can, sledgy. Had ten boxes of shotgun shells that I could not fit in the bag, so that's just sitting in there right now. But if we hop into the trailer and wait for it to load. I've got food, I've got water, so we're good to stay the night if we need to. Which is probably what I'm going to do until we clear out the hospital. Or die trying. Are we good? Nice, okay. Well, I'm going to go make some last minute preparations, and I will see you guys at the hospital. Already we are pulling up on the hospital now, getting the van in here was a pain in the half because all the cars that are blocking the road. But I made it through. I'm more worried about how I'm going to get out of here afterwards but here we are probably just gonna park up right here right here is looking real nice we've got some visitors pulling in i didn't turn off the engine there we go a bit laggy i think that's to be expected but i finally figured out how to dual wield with brutal handwork i gotta do is hold control and then press the the hotkey for a second your weapon and it does it look at this we got two nice sticks keith is finally rocking and rolling with full potential if I can hit the Zeds. Okay, that guy just fell over. I don't know what happened to him. But the dual nightstick's going to work. Look at that. I see you. Come on over. Take a bit of a smoke before we scout out the area. We got some... Right, let me do that. We've got some Zeds down here we can take care of. That's like Plaza looking in the parking lot, looking good. There's a scooter there. Very cool, it's a pizza scooter. Keith can become a little bit of a delivery man. Alright, time to get to work. I forgot to show off the stats for Keith. I could do that while they're, they're training up behind me. Favorite weapon is still the crowbar, survived for one month, 14 days, 19 hours, going on 2,100 Zeds killed. Very nice, weight is going down a little bit. Let's take the 
beta blocker. This might be the last one in the bottle, actually. It is. Alright, this is I think this is my last bottle of beta blockers at base. So I gotta make it work, but at least we're raiding a hospital, you know? There's definitely potential for finding more. Okay. Do I want to use the katana now? Because, I, I mean, there's no point in not using it, right? If it breaks, it breaks. It's gonna break eventually. Might as well. Get the one-shots in while I can. Saving some time. It is already 4 o'clock. We gotta clear this place out so we can sleep in the car. Or the trailer. So I cannot enter the trailer if there are Zeds around. I think like a 20 tile radius. Look at that. The first blood on the katana. Looking nice. Where are you? Ooh, an extra weapon. I will take that. Thank you, nurse. I think I'll just leave you on the floor right here for now. My biggest worry is fighting indoors. I have no clue what that place looks like. I gotta find out where my emergency my emergency exits are. But it'll be fun. It'll be fun indeed. How we looking? How many floors is that? Three, four, and then the roof. Can't tell. Hello, you. Goodbye, you. Oh, they're falling out of the roof. I saw that. Okay, let me get away from that. There we go. I need to see. Keith needs to be able to see. Double kill. Hello, doctor. I prescribe you with death. Oh, yeah. Keith is going strong at this thing. There's a shotgun cop in there. Oh yeah, there's quite a few in there. Uh, do I have the weapons that I want? The M4 is on, the M16 is M suppressed, the pistol is suppressed. I think we'll be fine. I could get out the grenades. The grenades could come in handy right now. Just, uh, even just to have them on me so I don't have to go rummage with them later. Let me go do that. Because if I get a horde following me and I have no way to deal with them in a timely manner, I'm going to be screwed. I want to be, I want to play this smart. Get the pipe bombs and the scrap bombs. No fire yet. I don't want to burn down this place just yet. But if it comes to that, I will. Fire is my last resort. Because I, I've, I've, I've done a lot of killing with fire. I want to do some killing with not fire. Bunk. And so we're trying to save Knox County, not burn it to, sh to smithereens and ash. Because after all those Zeds are dead, we're going to need this place. It is a hospital. A very big one. This place could be good for survivors. Bunk. I guess not really a bunk anymore. This is a katana. But who cares? We're having fun here. I gotta make sure they don't fall down on top of Keith here. Come on then, small groups at a time. The lag is immense. It is okay. Really hope this katana lasts a, not at least a, a, most of this killing spree. I do want to keep using it, but... Sometimes things aren't meant to be. Can I even repair it? No. Once it's gone, it's gone. I will keep it though when it breaks. That is, that is something I will do. Because I can make weapon racks. I did find that. It's in the, the building menu mod. Get away from me. Just gotta, gotta control the lag in situations like this. Come on then. Kill count is gonna skyrocket because of this. 100%. This is just the main lobby. There's a ton of them behind the reception as well. There we are. Beta blocker seems to have ended. Whatever we got. Come on, doctors. Come on out. 
Time to leave. It's time to clock out. Your service is no longer needed. You know what, let's switch back to the nightstick. Might not kill us quick, but it'll save on energy. At least I hope so. And I hope this bandana is going to be enough with corpse sickness. Because there are a lot of corpses and it's only going to become more. And these corpses are going to bring in more zeds, so we'll see how that goes. At least that's what I think it'll happen. What I think will happen. Right, we've, made some, we've made some breathing room in here. But they are just going to start flooding out. Could go back to dual wielding. Let's see. There you go, Keith. It is a weird button combination for me, but my control is also crouch. So, I gotta make sure I'm safe before I'm gonna dual wield like that. It seems like when, when Keith swings his left arm, he goes a little bit faster. That's pretty cool. I don't know why that is. Oh, you completely missed, Keith. What are you doing? Bring him around this way. This way is better for fighting. Back up. There we go. Good job, Keith. He's already it already. Should have bought a chair with me. Oh, that made me scared. But I don't like when that happens. I got, I got a little bit too close. Oy, again. You know. Exertion kills, folks. Remember that. Exertion jazziness. All those things. Right click did the thing again. That's how I got bit the other time on stream. And the click just decides, decides to give out. I don't know if it's the battery or what. Triple. Very nice. Okay. You good? Looking good. Yeah, I need a chair. Well, actually, no, I can just rest in the in the trailer as long as I'm clear. Let's see. I mean, I look clear enough. I should be far enough away, I think. If I'm not, that's gonna be that's an issue. That is an issue. Uh, does this work? My subdriver, where's that right here? Reduce fatigue game removing driving wheel. Mm, never mind. We either might just have to sit on the ground or go inside. Let's try the first option. The safer option first. There we go. Just a bit. Get the <laughs> nightstick specs out. Let's see. My English is very bad today. But yeah, let's go see what's going on in here. If we can get one of these chairs, that'd be real nice. Alright, come on. Hello, doctor. Time for you to go. Oh, they're starting to move now. Oh, got some visitors. wonder how the explosions are going to work. If I... Set a bomb off indoors. Is it gonna cause fire? Is it gonna destroy tiles? I don't know. I really don't know. It's more coming out. There we go. I also did not need to bring the sleeping bag with me, but I did. Oh well, that's fine. Good to have. Does weigh me down a little bit, I think. Double bonk. I'm glad I figured out how to do wield. This is so nice. Single file, folks. There we go. Stop trying to cut my answer. 
You get your turn. Okay, get away from the trailer. I need to be able to see. I'm not gonna pop a blocker. I can deal with this with panic. You can serve my blockers a bit. I'll try to fight as late as I can, but without getting drowsy. Because once I get drowsy, that's going to be bad. I need to clear as many as I can so I can sleep in the trailer. Or else I'm going to have to move it somewhere. There's the exertion again. To be expected. I hit you. Okay, thank you. Okay. Can I rest indoors? Nope, they keep on coming out. Never mind. Evening sun just came out, I think. Or was that just the warmth overlay? I think it was the warmth overlay. Hello, shotgun. Please die. I need to go rest. Thank you. Right over here. Go to 7 o'clock. There we go. Perfect. Back to it. No rest for Keith. Well, some rest for Keith. Ooh, do they have M9 mag? Hold on. So, I don't, I'm trying to find the shotgun that's semi-auto. But, I'm, I don't know. They might have removed it. I know the Spaz-12 is semi-auto. I haven't found one of those yet. Probably have to go to a military outpost for one of them. You guys are just walking right through the, the, the tables. I just, I just realized that. That's not good for me. Stop shoving him, Keith. Just kill her. You're wasting energy. I don't like it. Thank you. Okay, can I please get arrested? No, oh, we got one more coming in. Two more coming in. Seriously, Keith? Why how are you making so much noise? You haven't moved. I guess they're just they're just attracted to him. They can smell him. I see one, I kill one, and three more come out. Well, that's a lot more than three. Hello. Oh. Take a smoke real quick. Stop crouching, Keith. I guess uh, I could do a bit of fence trick in here. If the crowds get too big, try to section them off. Like so. Come on then. Okay, how many are floating out right now? That's quite a bit. I think we can bust out the pistol for this. You know so, look at this. Very cool animation. We want to aim in. It doesn't work. Great. Thank you, game. I just swung the nightstick. Oh, we can't do that anymore. Let me pop a blocker so I can aim correctly. They're already chowing down the corpses of them. There you are. You can join the corpses. Reload, swap mag, I didn't, okay, that's a, that's a mistake. I don't have the mags on me. How many are left? Four? Five, maybe? At least that has good stagger potential, these next six, because they're blunt. That's really what I want, just to slow them down a bit. Thank you, mouse, for just right clicking out of nowhere. Even though I'm holding it down to aim, I don't understand it. Okay, I have some time to grab the stuffs. Right, there's quite a few out now. Yeah, they got the corpses. Okay. 
Uh, where are my mags? Right there. Is that it, really? Hmm. I won't complain. At least I got some. Eagle Eye Keith, ready to go to work. Yeah, they really like those corpses. That was like instant. Look at them. Disgusting. I would not have a better idea to just crouch, really, just to get my sneak level level up. Also, because aiming is super cool. While you're crouched. We love Keith. Got a flanker next to the trailer. I see you. Oh, they switched over. Nice. 8 o'clock or 8 p.m. 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. Is that right? That sounds right. Hey there, you. Time to go. Jesus, here we go. This is where the fun begins. There's a crossbow in that nurse's bag. I think this might be a grenade potential right here. Not that I'm looking at it. That's a pretty target rich environment, if I do say so myself. Let me see. How do I do this? I equip it. And then let me not throw it at the car. Let me get those magazines back in here since I don't need them anymore. There's no ammo yet. I gotta refill them. Let's see. If I throw it right there, run away. Kaboom. Please. It does make fire. Okay. Oh, good to know now. Why am I moving so slow? Keith, what is going on with you? You okay? Is that normal speed? Really? Or is it because I'm exerted? I can't tell. I hope that fire goes out. I really do. If it doesn't, I'm gonna lead him this way. It seems to be killing them pretty quick. The noise brought out some more as well. Looks like with the corpses, either one. Either way, this 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 parking lot's gonna be a, a battleground when I'm done with it. Slow and steady. That's how we're doing this. Perhaps I should have parked the RV down the road. Just so I can sleep in it, but... Too late now. How's the fire going? I think we're good. I don't see any Zeds over there. I need to go grab some ammo. I don't want to use the M16 yet. We did, I don't... I mean, I guess I could. We've got ammo. We got a few boxes. Might as well. It's gonna be low. But that's what it's for. It's time to, it's time to make some noise. Get them all outside. Because I'm not fighting indoors with Keith. At least not yet. I see you over there. How does it look like crouched? That's very cool. Very cool indeed. Oh, they are on the roof. Look at that. There's one sole person on that roof. I am going to run out of ammo, though, so let me go grab that. Well, they hit the herd is thin. Thin enough, anyway. Oh, they are spreading the fire. Okay. The hospital might be gone. I don't know what they're going to do with that fire. 9 mil. There we go. 5.56. Five, five, Boom. Perfect. So fire might just have to happen. I mean, it's okay by me. I'm killing Zed, so I'm happy. 
and they deserve it. They bit Keith. Don't forget that. I kind of retconned it by disabling the mod because it was breaking my game, but it did happen. I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna ignore that. All right, time to reload this. Oh yeah, we're gonna be here for a few days. I'm not sleeping in the RV. That's not gonna happen. Tell you what, let me get the other bomb out, the scrap bomb. This seems like it's gonna be not fire. Yeet. How do I fire? Don't sit down, Keith. Do I need a lighter? Is that what it is? That would make sense. Secondary. Turn it off, Keith. Why is it on? Yeet. There we go. Oh yeah, those are nice. No fire. That's what I want. The only problem is my lighter's about to go. But um I mean there is no but that's 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 it. My lighter is about to go. Shotgun would probably be better for this. Let me hop over the fence here. Jowsiness hasn't started yet, but I'm gonna have to take these guys into the forest so I can get to the van. Am I out of... Yeah, do this. I've got some time. Repack the mag. Any day, Keith. There you go. Alright, let me go back to the, the hospital. Cut through the trees. Oh, there are you. Oh, yeah. This is on board for you. If you haven't seen hordes, this is a horde and a half. Oh wow, this is a mission. This is at least a couple thousand. Maybe maybe two thousand. Right there. I'm not sure, I'm not good at counting, but... That's what it feels like to me. We're making progress, slowly but surely. Are you okay? How many we got left? You've got some... 5, 5, 6 left. That's like 2 more mags. 60, yeah. 60 divided by 2. There goes the van. It's not gonna burn down, but I'm not gonna get it for a while. I'm bringing some from the road, it seems. Let's head back down this way. In these situations, you gotta just keep calm, but not too calm. You wanna, you wanna still be alert. I think that's where I messed up on the live stream. But just 
Combat alert. That's really the name of the game. And be overprepared. Definitely. You don't want to be underprepared. That was a double. Nice. Alright, the fire definitely spread. So, that'll help me out. Tell you what, while they're, while they're busy burning themselves, let me just leave. I can come back in the morning, they'll probably be dead. I can head up to the tech warehouse. Sleep up there. I know that place is safe. The fire station ain't that safe, but the, the tech warehouse right next to it, pretty safe. I could also just head home. But I think I'm going to make this a longer episode. Maybe, maybe, maybe not too long. Maybe a few minutes longer than usual. But I think... I'm going to have to deal with these guys before I head in. Food. I put all the food in the RV. Or the trailer, I guess. I'm going to need to get to that. But I'm not too far from home. If I need to go back, I can. Rock the old Shoelace Express back, back to home. If I need to. It's always something I can do. It's always a little safe haven. Level 2 exertion. Gotta go inside. How are we looking? Oh yeah, our fitness and strength went back down to level 6 because when you chop off your arm, both of them go back down a level, so yeah, that might mess with us. Uh, the sprinting's going up. A lot of things are going up. Check the kills. How are we looking? 2,483. Very nice. Okay, I need a good spot to sleep. Some place with a door. I think the bathroom might be our best bet. It's not to clean this place, but it'll have to do. Let me see, how do I do this? Unroll. Unencrypt that. Set sleeping bag right there. Okay, let me get drowsy first before I pop a beta blocker. So you have to do this in the correct order, otherwise you won't sleep. Okay, now that I can't see anything, I can just sleep. Oh, nice. Alright, I will see you guys back at the hospital. Alrighty, we are back. Looks like there were quite a few out here. The fire is still going. I just wanna, I wanna get a little, little welfare check before I head out for today's episode. How's it looking? I need to get in here. Get the katana out. I need to guarantee one hit kills. We got plenty of fence still. We can still use that. How's the fire going? Looking good, honestly. It did take out quite a few. But it is burning the fences, I think. Yeah, it is. I just saw that one go. I don't know how it's burning metal fences and turning them wood, but it is. Take a smoke while we got a chance. Is that? Oh, that's one of the, 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 the cure zeds right there. Oh, he's gonna... Oh, no. I gotta... I don't know if I can kill him. He's gonna just turn to ash. I need that cure. Just in case we get bit again. No, don't burn ash. Can I can I do it? Yes, got it. Okay, one cure, bam. So just in case we get bit again, we can we can survive. That was a close call. I almost didn't get that. I was afraid I was gonna jump in the fire. I'm the biker. You are no match for my katana. There are still quite a few, I hear. Yeah, more coming from down over there where I'm facing now. See what you. Put that katana. Maybe we can find another katana. Who knows? There are a lot of Zeds here. There's a good chance. Oh, there's, there's a chance. I don't know about a good chance. The are starting to show up behind me. Gotta watch out for the fence lunges. Hello, Zed's time to die. Undead freak bags, get out of here. Okay, you are making me annoyed. Stop making all that noise. Can't hear a thing. With all that munching. Oh, there's another cure Zed right there. Okay, we are good. 
The mods are working. Bunk. I kind of just want to kill whoever's out here right now. And get out if I can. I also need to get the food, but I can't enter there. Or the Zeds are nearby. So it's kind of just a... I don't even know. I don't even know what to call it. It's just a bloodbath, really. At least for now, there are slow shamblers. These guys are breathing now. Gotta watch out for the flaming ones, though. That might actually be the last of the fire. I was off on one pipe bomb, by the way. That fame's gonna go out soon. There you go. Right on cue. Oh, you're munching right there. I almost didn't see you. Camouflaged. The black clothing on the ash. Okay, I don't want to get it right next to you. That's why. Right there. Nice. Just a few more, I think. Look at all the ash. See, all this ash was Zed. So that just that just tells you how many died here from the fire last night. But I do have a mod that makes the fire do a bit more damage quicker, so that you're not spending days corralling zombies that are on fire. You just gotta wait like a night and they'll be dead, which is very nice. Exertion is coming back. Food is gonna be an issue soon. I can tell. You've been hungry since yesterday. This katana's gonna go. It's gonna be sad. Or I could save it at like 1% durability. That's also a thing I could do. Just put it in the camper trailer. Keep it there forever until I get back home. And then put it up on my trophy wall or something. Whenever I make it. Keith, you don't have to shove. You're exactly the same distance you were two seconds ago. I mean, you're swinging at them. You don't need to shove. I think after we deal with these guys, we should be able to enter the trailer. I hope so. Oh, lag. Always. Always lag. What am I hearing? There's no one here. Oh, you're under the car. How did that happen? What? Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna question that. Okay, let's get off the- Oh, I didn't see you. That's my bad. Next stick's gonna go soon. I have a surplus of them. Not really surplus. I've got, I've got like six extras in the van. In the bag. Bye, please. Thank you. Alright, let's see. The music has calmed down. That's a good sign. They are still coming, though. And I can't necessarily drive out of here. I mean, hmm. I guess I might have to. Let's see, let me reload the pistol. Because I need some bullets. And I don't want to make that much noise. Okay, let's see. Is it just you two? It would really make my day if it's just you two. Why is there glass on the floor? Was that there before? Okay, well, you're not reloading because I didn't unpack the boxes. That makes sense. Nice. We still have 120 rounds and 9 mil ready to go. Can I please enter this trailer? Yes. Okay. Good. We've made progress. That is good progress. Okay. Uh, Keith, I'm going to need you to just down a whole box of cereal right now. Thank you. Wait, flatlined. Nice.
What is up guys, Kills in here and welcome back to the Noxville trip. So we are right where we left off at the hospital in the blood slash ash bath that it is. Heath is out here bright and early, 8.20 a.m. Uh, let's see, 2,646 kills, 1 month, 15 days, four, or 12 hours survived, weight as fight night at 77. Actually, before I get into this, I have to go grab some supplies here. Let me just take a quick peek. Yeah, I need to refill my lighter so that I can actually use my bombs. Where is my shotty? Shotgun's in one of these bags, I believe. How's my lighter doing? Lighter's good now, okay. We almost had a problem with that last episode, there's the shotty. Uh, I put the katana away in the trailer as well as, actually no, I think that's it, just yeah, the katana and the sheath, because they were about to break. Uh, I dropped my broken nightstick in the trailer as well. We could put the shoddy away in here, as long as the ammo for it. I could put this on my belt. Actually, no, I, uh, I mean, am I really going to put it on the M16? It does take durability every time I put it on. So I think I'll take it off for now, because I have 5.56 five, that I can still use. I don't have a lot of it. But I still have some. But I think for now, we're going to deal with the stragglers outside. Doesn't seem like there's that many. And they're kind of slow for the next 20 minutes. So we've got to get moving. Let me just see. There we go. Okay, forgot to do something. But we are good starting now. Okay, let's get it. Come on, lads. Oh, preemptive swing. There we go. We are 2-2 two, two over weight. On the right side there. Because we'll have to stop a cannon. But hopefully that gets less and less as we fight. Come on, Keith, you can do it. I should probably be using the night stuff. It'll be quicker. And use less stamina and things like that. Come on, Keith. There we are. I think all of his weapon stats are like basically around the same levels. Check that out. Yeah. They're all going to like level 5 or level 4. Very nice. I hope my right click doesn't give out on me today. I really need a new mouse, I think. This mouse has been through quite a bit. I think I've only had it for about a year, so. Oh, maybe I did something wrong with it. I just messed up the right click because how much games I play that require it. Especially this one. I like, I really put some force on the right click. Which is probably unhealthy for the mouse. So it's, it's probably my fault. Alright, come on. You have something on your leg? No, that's just weird clipping. Right, they are moving quicker now. Let's pop a blocker. There's noise to that now? The mod got updated, but that doesn't make sense. Usually. Actually, it does make sense. That's cool. I did not expect that. Beta blockers make noises now. I wonder what else makes noise. I think that's kind of the part of the medical meister mod. That sounds right. Hey, we got some twins here. Look at that. Gray-headed and gray-haired twins. Okay, we're gonna need some multi-hit action. We might have to switch to the gun. There we go. We have attracted quite a bunch. I don't want to use... Hmm. I guess, yeah, we use the M16 so that way I can get the shotgun out quicker. There we go. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, how much? 5.56? Five, five, 15 left. I can fill up the mag one more time in a few. Actually, right now it might be... Oh, well, I see you. Let's do some up here. Nice, Keith. Plus one in aiming. Where am I at now? Level five aiming. Going to level six now. We've got some friends coming in. All right, come in. Get some get some more bullets in that dang. How did that happen? The, oh, the hospital is burning. This might make, job, make my job easier. I did not want it to happen, but... We are... We gotta do what we gotta do. That's what I'll say about it. I thought I controlled it quite well, but I guess a Zed wandered off, and now the whole thing is going up. Hmm. Well, now I gotta be extra careful of everyone's side. Did I bring noisemakers? I don't know if I did. If I didn't, that's that's a bad on my part. I kind of kind of wanted to use them in this episode, just kind of throw them along the walls. 
because that should bring out Zeds. But uh, I guess Keith is the noise maker. See, they're coming out already. There's a back parking lot as well. I don't know what's over there. Those are some secondary buildings that I haven't seen yet on the, the other side. I guess that, yeah, the south side because Keith is on the north side right now. It's M16's putting on work. Okay. Take a little smoky. How are we doing? We got seven rounds left, and then I can drop this M16 back off in the trunk. And then never pick it up again until we find somewhere. 556. Five, hey, that's empty. Okay. Let's run back real quick. Let's get the shoddy prepared. Come on, shoddy. This is where we're really going to get some kills on, I think. Okay, unequip this, please, Keith. Unequip. Put it away for now, and then unload these. I hope I can walk while doing that. I can. I still got that pitchfork I can use. We exerted already. Yeah, that makes sense from the, the weight. M16, bye-bye. For now. Probably for a long while. Okay, how can I drop my weight? Put the pipe bombs away. Those things cause fires. I don't want to cause any more fires. You're kind of close. There we go. I'm just going to leave the trunk open. Yeah, I'm probably going to just have to go loud for a while now so I can rest later. I should be able to sit somewhere. Maybe in the van might be safer. But I got some, got some visitors coming over. Hello there. Hope that thunderstorm isn't on its way. Well, it is on its way, but... Hopefully we've got some time. Okay, can I get a rest in real quick? I'm gonna sit on the passenger side. Just so I have a little bit more time, hopefully. Go to 10 a.m. Looks like they didn't follow me. That's nice. Okay, cool. Very nice. Water is fine. You've got meds, you've got pistol. Everything is looking handy dandy. Well, I mean, I guess we can use the pipe bombs since this place is already going up in flames. I guess we should use all the resources we have, right? That seems, that seems logical. Hello, fellas. How's it going? You guys are not worth shotguns. You are not shotgun worthy. Get out of here. Hey, you stay away. Hey, no. Can't be having that. Flaming Zeds. No, no, no. Might as well top off while there's nobody here. The ashes are nice. I think, I don't know if I said it earlier, but I'm gonna say it again. The ashes mean that the Zeds won't be pathfinding to corpses. There are still corpses. They didn't burn all of them, but there's gonna be a lot of ashes. And ashes means better for me. Oh, yeah, the whole place is going up. Cafeteria, somebody burned their things in the microwave. I wonder if it was Cool Flames or not. Maybe he's been here. That'd be funny. How's it looking? I think the cafeteria actually isn't that bad right now. Still got a half wave it to go. Let's check out the back. See what's going on. I didn't expect to clear it this, this fast, but, um... Seems like we went through the, the brunt of it. In our first little trip down here. In the last episode. Shotgun's putting in work, though. Probably should save my ammo. Only got 100 shells. Seems like a lot, but you can really do some damage with it. And it'll go away quick. Before you know it, you'll be out of ammo and near death. That's a nice van. That's a, what was that, the brewery van? I think that's what that logo is. I'll take a look in a second. Let's see. If we can get this van, that'll be a nice little travel van. And the van. The vans are just good for everything, I guess. Except for tight spaces. They do not like tight spaces. This is, yeah, the distillery. This could actually have stuff. This could have bourbon. That's oh, locked. Okay, we have to come back to that. See what we can do here. Uh, there's, there's, a, there's a few out here. Some in the woods, that's what I'm really, really kind of worried about, is how many are in the woods. Because you know Zombud, if you know Zombud, they put Zeds in the woods. 
You'll never see them until you go into those trees, but they are there. Luckily, I was smart and put a suppressor on the shotgun, so we're only, only going to attract the ones we want to attract. But I can't be wasting these shells. How are we looking? Get the pistol out. Nice. Okay. Got a visitor up there. He'll be walking over here shortly. Gonna kill who I can before he gets here. He's hopping over the fence now. Got a couple down there. More coming from the forest. So we reload, but we got the chance. There you go, Keith. That's what we, what we do right now, is just clear the perimeter. And once the perimeter is clear, we can really start moving. Oh, hello there. Is that a machete? It is. We've got a katana and a machete on this run. That's almost perfect. Okay, well, I'm going to have to replace the knife. There we go. Can I put the, mach the, not the machete, the knife on this? No. Sadly, I cannot. It might be like a trench shotgun that yeah, you could probably go on, but this shotgun doesn't work. Okay, that, that, I feel like that should have hit, Keith. Like, you have some pretty good aiming. You have level 5 aiming, you should be able to hit something that close. Alright, let's fill up our mag. This place looks in, looking real nice, looking real clear. I did not mean to rack the gun. We good? We're good. Okay. Let's check out this van. See what's going on. Can't believe it's already been 10 minutes in this recording. Does not feel like it. Let's see. Can I get in here? Is the door open? It is. I was about to bust that thing open if I could. Hey, more leather gloves. Okay, I thought that said something different. We've got the, the key. That's nice. Let's see what's in this trunk. There's some bourbon. Very nice. You can just drop this on the floor, actually. Don't need any of that. Will it run, I wonder? That's really what I want. Battery's dead. Gas is dead. But the rest of it is good. Okay. We are marking this on the map. Here we are. Van. Make it red. Make a note as well. Black so I can read it. No gas. I put zero instead of no. Take a less space, zero gas, zero bat. Here we go. That's a heavy duty battery, I think. Should be. I should know that. Make sure that's closed. There we go. Uh, I'll put the machete up here, actually. Because Keith has more in short blade than long blunt, I think. Oh, this would be long blade then. Yeah. Okay, nice. Keith is just a master with long blade. He used it a lot in the beginning. Which came in handy for the for the for the katana. Let's do with you. I see you, Miss Headband. I guess you were you were a hospital resident. I think. I said yeah, that's a bandage. Almost that was part of her hairdo. I know that is a bandage. Right, let's see what's going on down here. Good lord. Yeah, we're just gonna have to let this place cook. I don't want to go in there and get Keith dead. That's a sentence. But yeah, I don't want to risk stepping on a fire and then. Keith cooking in there. I can, I do have the stop, drop, and roll mod. So if I do get on fire, I just, I have like a, a millisecond to react to it. So I may or may not be able to live from that. But it looks like the fire is still raging on this side. I'm not going to cut through the wilderness. I'll go all the way back around. Keep it safe. Keep it secure. We might have to go check out the front. We can go check out the secondary buildings. There's a, there's a quite... A couple things we can do. Let's see, I hear them munching. So they're not all aware of what's going on. This place got cooked. Munching away somewhere in here. Get the pistol out. There we go. Double tap. Two boots, two kills. Water dispenser there. Might fill up on the water while I'm here. They destroyed the reception. Well, the fire destroyed the reception. 
There we go. Nice. Well, let's check out the little drive through here. See what's going on out front. How much of this do I have to worry about? That's all glass. That's cool. We got a little, little plaza over here. Little bird fountain thing. All the glasses brokey. I'm guessing the fire is going to take the whole hospital. Because I don't really think it's going to stop. Unless the thunderstorm stops it. That could be something that happens. Like, who can I see? Someone's on something here. On one of the windows. Can't really see. I'll just shoot them through the window here. There we go. This is the secondary entrance, I think. Or maybe the main entrance. I'm not sure. No. Yes? Yes. This is the main entrance. Oh. Cool. We've got some more clearing to do. But they hurt that. Could chuck some bombs in here. I don't know if the bombs will actually go through the glass or not. I don't want to risk that. Could chuck some bite bombs. Really burn this place up. Because we definitely can't save it anymore. The other side of the building is on fire. I'll shoot who I can, though. I'm not going to miss that. I don't want to get too close. Shotgun time is coming up, though. Definitely. As soon as they all start moving to me. Yep, there we go. Reload Keith, just to have that on standby. Let's get to work. We're gonna need to pop another blocker. Boom. Eat lead, zombie scum. It's time for you to leave. This is Keith's world. He's gonna liberate it. One shot at a time. Ooh, you've got some... Some candidates here. We got a traffic jam down there, spiffos. Oh, yeah. Okay, is that a... It's a water truck. How does this... Me and Cool Flames found one of these. In... Actually, that episode isn't out yet. That'll be out on Wednesday. I don't know if I showed it or I might have cut it out. But we did find one of these trucks. And I'm wondering, how does it work? I might have to go into the, the hood to see. That's usually where the hidden stuff is. See if I can actually put stuff in that in that water container. Because the trunk has like 12 space, so it's not it's not a storage vehicle for for solids. But for liquids, I'm not too sure. It might work. It might not. Who knows? I hope they modded that in. Because if they did, that'd be cool. Also, see another trailer down there. So if anything, we can grab the van, the distillery van, and then grab that trailer, and we can have a whole new kit right there ready to go. For a road trip. I see another crowbar here, though. Thank you. Very nice. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, let's see. Let's see what's going on here. It has no hood or no top. That's pretty cool. How does this work? Cab cover. Battery and gas are gone. Water tank. I don't know how that works, I'm gonna be real. If anybody knows, let me know down in the comments, but other than that, I'm not too sure. Might have to go to the actual mod page for that, but this car right here, looking sick, looking real nice. Of course, we have lots of vans as well to choose from if you want them. Right there. A little double tap there. Let's see, what is this? Let me in. Uh, no key. That's fine. Could also be on the floor somewhere. 58 space. That's about right for a car like this. Is a key on the floor somewhere? Nope. Okay. Look in the hood. See what's going on. No gas, no battery. Engine's kind of shot. Uh, well. It's here if we want it later. Repair it. But right now, we ain't looking for th nothing like that. Looks like they're chowing down already. Let's see, what bombs do I have? 
I've got the I got the one pipe bomb. I could go inside real quick, chuck that in. See what happens after that. Hello, fellas. Good to see you. Time to die. Reload. I'm using the wrong menu for reloading. Come on, then. I saw that outline. Give it back to me. Why don't you just shoot your friends instead? I messed up. I don't know why you can't do this. You can't shoot through the board. There we go. You have a super kill there, I think. It's you as well. Reload. We got 41 rounds left. Didn't kill you. You're still up. Can't exactly hit you though. There we go. And if you don't know, hold alt if you're trying to hit something on or hit a Z on the floor. It'll automatically put you into the shooting down position or hitting down position when you swing or shoot. Pro tip. Helps you out in a pinch. Hello. I gotta repack my mags. Take him around for a little shawl. I'm being smart today. I'm not gonna be dumb and just head in there. Try to take it easy. We've got plenty of time to do this. We're not we're not on a time time schedule or refrain or nothing. We're just we're just here to clear it out. Be calm and collective. I'm loving the new sounds. That is so cool. Like I'm like I'm playing Tarkov. Uh, you survived. Look at you. Lucky fella, you get the crowbar to the head treatment. There you go. Alright, we pack these mags, Keith. Last mag, I think, right now. Seven bullets, yep. Alright, this is it for the Glock. Until we find more 9 mil. They are all on those windows. Yeah. Oh, we got rain. Look at that. Clean up the blood. Give me more frames. I appreciate it. I went the shotgun on that door. Thank you. No, oh, jams. Come on. Why does he keep doing that? Alright, one last bullet. Goes to you, sir. Give me that shotgun. Bye bye. M500, another nightstick. Nice. Got the machete. This is a weapon I am confident in using. Is it can multi hit, I think, from what I remember. Okay, unless I'm stupid and I die right here, but that's fine. Everything's good. There we are. And a bunk. Okay, that's more of a shink, but we'll go with bunk. Get the shotty out there, but it breaks something down. There goes the door. Keep on falling from the, from the skies, too. The balconies on the second floor or whatever. Reload where I got a chance. Oh, they got the boards down. Okay. That's another point of entry for them. A point of exit, I should say. It's a point of entry for Keith, but... We've got doors right here, so I don't think I'm gonna use them. Unless we have to. Like an emergency. Oh, I got him while he was falling. That was cool. And this place is just a bloodbath, and I love it. There's a spear in that, nurse. Goodbye. They are coming from upstairs, though. That is kind of a worry. We are running low on shoddy shells. We switch over to the... Machete. There we go. So at least one on that three board right in front of Keith there. Might be two now. Sounds like two. Gotta watch out for those lunges. Those will get you killed. Keith is feeling a bit peckish, but we can go on for longer. We got a few chocolate bars. You can nibble on anywhere. Like I said, I'm prepared today. 
prepared as I can be. Hello, you guys. There we are. Reload while I can. And bump. You're going to come through? Nice, thank you. We can serve good, and there we go. Exerted. Crap. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I think that, that'll be the play. We'll go back to the van, drop some stuff up that we don't need anymore. Like the, the Glock and things. Unless you gotta see the shotgun shells and these other shotgun. We got a military knife. That's nice. Alright, let's start backing off. Uh, other shotgun. There are shells. I'll note that. Never mind, that's gonna take four years to do. And we do a little bit of this. Very nice. Keep backing up. First comes a shove, we'll just light this place up with fire. If we run out of ammo, which we definitely will. We are gonna need to go on a resupply mission someday. Which I do have one spot we gotta go to. That that big old ship. But still, something we gotta do. You might just have to skip over a few times. Or towns. To get there. That'll be the, the hard part. Is getting there. Clearing it, probably also hard. But we've got grenades and things. We can stockpile. Alright, we gotta get back to the van. Was that? I just realized there's benches all over this. So we can actually rest up here. If we need to. Hold on. Make sure you're not going to lunge at me. Thank you. For being kind, Zeds. Kind to Keith. There we are. Don't lunge. Thank you. I use coughing for exertion. I can kill these two. Thank you. This machete might break sooner than I anticipated. Doesn't seem to want to last that long. Okay, let's head back now. I wonder if the, the rain clears up ash. I think it does. I think I think I have that, that option ticked on. Let's see. Yeah, I just saw one disappear there, I think. I think it just takes a while, because this is only light rain. This might be the beginning of the thunderstorm. Now that I think about it. How are we looking? Any new fellas want to show up? No, nice. Okay, good. That's what we like to see. Okay, let's see. Put that away. Thank you. Put this away. Put the bourbon away. The shotgun we have to unload. Cobra can go away. Put the mags away. Bayonet can go. Uh, save the chocolate. We're going to unload this. At the racket as well. There we go. Put those in the belt now that I have room. There we are. Uh, what is that? That's just a holster. Okay, what else? Can do nothing with that. Military knife. We can keep that sort. Could I use this? No. Okay, yeah. that's fine. Nice. Okay. What is up, guys? Kills in here, and welcome back to the next road trip. We're right where we left off in the last episode. We're ready to just keep on clearing out this hospital as best we can with ETH. So, while we're walking over there, let me show you his stats. As I said, we are on the same day of 1 month, 15 days, 19 hours. Weight is going down now, slightly. We have killed 3,207 Zeds. We have killed quite a few. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to go back over to that main entrance side. Yeah, this is the emergency lane here for ambulances to go right into the emergency room that makes more sense move that over i think this might as yeah this is my last uh bottle of beta blockers so we might have to be wary about that but we can rest up here before we head in looking nice we're good rain is i think getting a bit stronger than what it was in the last episode hopefully it doesn't get too bad Keith is still going strong with the machete, though. Look at that. 
I could also dual wield. I think I might do that. Look at that. If you had two machetes, I know we do at home, I think. That would be very cool. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. Yeah, they should still be trying to migrate to the corpses, I think. And there's Spear Lady. Another one, I think. Spears are actually quite nice. I don't really think it cares about your level on them. Spears are just very good. Except for the little animation lock that they do sometimes. You gotta be careful about that. But other than that, they're pretty good. Let's get the shotgun out for this. I don't want to risk this. I don't like the lag. Another cop or a ranger of some sort. Reload and then get the shotty out. The shetty, machete, whatever. Same thing. I like making up nicknames. Gunship blade. Hmm. We'll keep it. Might be able to use it. Who knows? Probably. Duffel bag, cologne. Don't need. You've got enough of them. Yeah, look at the little carpet of Zeds we got coming out here. Oh, you're trying to flank me. I see you. Trying to pull some advanced tactics. Right back into the action, it seems. Very nice. Machete might go. Hopefully it doesn't, I think. Yeah, we can repair it if we get some duct tape or something, I think. You know? What does the most here? Other strips, really? How oh, many tailoring four? Oh, well. If we get tailoring four, we can really do it quite easily. I think that's, a, that's new to the mod. Or some mod. And that wasn't there when I... In the early days of the series, I would think. Is that what it is? A shiv? No, it's a bread knife. Of course it is. It's always a bread knife, no matter what. Yeah, this machete's gonna go. I can feel it. I feel it in me bones. Oh, we're getting surrounded a little bit. Back off. Don't know where y'all are coming from. Coming from somewhere. That's all I know. Somewhere down there. Is that the southeast? Alright, shoddy time again. 42 shells remaining. Try to get the most out of it. Oh, right click, don't do it. Please don't start with me. Don't start with me, right click. Seriously, don't do it. I was about to shoot this guy in the face, I don't wanna do that. You're right here, can I get you from here? Can't, that sucks. Someone's munching. Where are you? Kind of hard to see them when they're munching. Especially in a pile of corpses like this. There we go. Nice. Right through the head. Get you as well. What else we got? Looking good. I just want to take a screenshot real quick. This is this is kind of a milestone. I want to show this off. Right, uh, and then, bam. That's good enough. Uh, I could do better. Hold on. I just want this to go away. But it won't because of the keybinds. There we go. That works. Hopefully one of those is good. I might use them as a thumbnail too. That could actually be pretty nice, but... These little behind-the-scenes actions for y'all. Trying not to cut anything, because this is just going to be madness through and through. It is 4 p.m. You do got to be wary about the time. Get you. Come on. Oh, there we go. Looks like we cleared out the main lobby. I'm not too sure about the second or third or fourth floor, but... Main lobby's clear. So we didn't need to burn it. That's very nice. Let me just see, how much is our sneak level going off? Because that is actually a good way of seeing how many are around. It doesn't seem to be going up at all. Uh oh. Let's get back out of here. It's a little bit of sneakage. There we go. Break their ankles. If they weren't broken already. Coming out then. All four of you. Beta blockers seem to have worn off. I'm gonna need a smoke as well. Okay. Smoke first. There's no cigarettes? Oh, okay, I gotta unpack them. Alright. 
Beta blockers then. We can worry about the smoking later. Beta blockers in panic. I need to worry about that first. Always. Nice. Very nice. Good job, Keith. She can't, apparently. It is cool that they speak sometimes. It does add a little bit more to it, I think. The experience. Okay, cigarettes. Unpack one. She gave me 20 more. Yes. Have a little smoke while they walk towards me. Another shotgun for me. I see you. Nice. Come on, then. And a little bit of the shook action. There we go. Another M500. I will unload. And then, where'd you put it? Right there. Rack it. Drop it. I don't want to carry any more weight than I have to right now. How many shells do we have? We have 41. So we can take out a few groups. If we need to. But we're going pretty good with melee only right now. As long as they keep up at this rate. Not too sure how many are left. It's really just the other floors I'm worried about. I can deal with the first floor. Other floors are going to be a hassle. I can definitely hear them above me. I don't want to move forward when they come down these stairs. That'll be that'll be bad. But I think it's open enough where I'll be fine if I go this way. I was hoping the claustrophobia doesn't kick in. We'll check out what's in here though. This place looks like a little shop. Let's see. What have we got? Oh, one behind me. I see you. Two behind me. Where'd you come from? Stairs? That's what I'm guessing. Yeah, they come down the stairs. They can hear me above. That makes no sense, but okay. That's just the way Zomboid works. Coming from outside? Hmm. Strange. How are they following me in, from outside? They just kind of seem to be peering out of nowhere. I don't know. I know they aren't, but it's just kind of what it seems like. Alright, let the group down. Eight minutes in, how many kills we got? We've got like 200 kills. That is insane. I love this game. Oh, get it again, Keith. Come on. Here you go. You shoved instead of killing. Where are you going, sir? You going to the corpses? Oh, both of you. <laughs> that guy was like, what was that? I heard something. Let me turn around and get my face chopped up. Alright, can I see what's in here now? Thank you. Ooh, it's all food. Okay. Hold on. Let me put on the proxy. I'm gonna take all the good stuff. Jar of chocolate wafer sticks. Hmm. That sounds delish. But I don't need it right now. I need all the good stuff. All the big things. Jocks! Good to see you. I will take you. And a bear. Why not? Dead rat. I'm not taking you. <laughs> Uh, what else we got? Take a little gift shop, I guess. There we go. More magazines to read. Always nice. Coloring book. Anything else? If the fire gets up. Batman Spiffo. Give me that. Freddy the Fox. It's Foxy the Fox, but okay. I'll let you go. I'll let you go with that. Okay, let's get out of here. He's like, my claustrophobia is kicking back in. Or Keith's claustrophobia, I should say. We need to eat. Have some chocolate. Oh, I did not mean to sprint. That's my bad. Because of how my keybinds are. Eat the rest of that. Get our hunger out the way. Weight is still going down. That's fine. Alright, come on. Are you a sir? I think, yeah, you're a sir. Couldn't tell, but I found out in the end. The air is still coming down these stairs, which means there are still a lot of them right there. I could yell. That'll probably get them all down, which I might do. Let's do it. Let's yell once. See what that does. 
speed up time a bit. Not one of those mad. Somewhere. Can't really tell where. Ah, uh, here we go. It did work. Nice. Come on then. Yeah, if they come down like this, this'll be this'll be fine. Okay, maybe okay, hold on, hold on. Just hold on. Hold on. I say that and then they all come down the stairs at once. Let's get the shotty out. We can deal with this though. That's what the shotgun's for. We good? How are we doing? I feel like my voice is going away a bit. Which makes sense. I am recording this right after the last episode, so I would be I wouldn't be surprised. Come on, I see you. You see me. Let's get this over with. There we go. Is that door unlocked? No. Let's do that. Just in case. Nothing in that. I'm gonna leave my proxy on for now. This is a lot of tailoring levels. It is very nice. I hear you. I'm bunk. Okay. Oh, no, some more. I'm gonna try to kill as many as I can that come down these stairs. Because once I go up there, I'm gonna have to be on my A game. I'm gonna be in my S game, actually. Because they are they are on all sides of the stairway, I think. That's what it sounds like. I don't even know what this is. This is like a I don't even know. I really don't know. Where is the fire? That's what I'm worried about. Where where is the fire at right now? Because I'm pretty sure the thing is actively still going. But also, maybe not. Maybe the rain actually put it out. He might have actually saved the hospital. It's definitely gonna need a bit of rebuilding, but Half of the hospital still stands. The main doors are still up. Well, not the doors themselves, but you get what I mean, right? Cafeteria's here. We actually made it to the other side. Hello, you. It is kind of dark. I didn't bring my light because that thing just wakes me down and I never use it. Bunk. I'm hearing them munching all around. I don't like it. Not one bit. The vending machine is still up. There is bacon in that vending machine. I'll take the pickles, though. Bacon's rotten. Hello, guys. Come on. What are you stuck on? I can't tell. I don't like this. Come on. There's nothing there. What are you doing? I'll just shoot you. You little goobers. Getting stuck on air. Alright, let's see what you do. I see the one behind me at the window. Gotta use your peripherals. Very useful. Man, look at that. We have free exit right here. Alright, yeah, the rain is starting to come down heavy. I think the thunderstorm might be in the next day or two. Look at that. The ashes are going away now. Nice. We are exerted. Let's head back to the RV. Don't hop over the fence. Let us just use more stamina. Hello. Another spear for me. Thank you. Scrap shiv spear. Okay, nice. Let's put away this stuff. We got some visitors up here as well. I see you. You see me. Time to get it over with. Goodbye. Everything good up here? Oh, yep. I could take the time to burn these corpses. That's not a bad idea, now that I say it out loud. But I'm gonna leave that for another time, I think. That'll probably be the last thing we do. Just get all the corpses burnt so that this place is actually secure. Uh, it's not good for now. By the way, the spears. There we go. Nice. Have a bit of a rest. Stay here for a couple of minutes. 
Cool. Yeah, rain is starting to pour. We've got a few hours left before we have to call it quits for the day. Check it. Take a look at the kill count. 3,300 Zeds killed. One month, 15 days, or 16 days now, almost. One hour remaining. Favorite weapon is still the crowbar. Weight well, has gone up, but it's also going down. Actually, no, it's still going down. Never mind. We have to worry about that. Actually, yeah, we do have to worry about that. Because if that gets down below 75, we're not going to be good. So, let me eat this. Just to try to flatline it for now. We're going to burn a lot of calories doing this anyway, so we got to be a little bit more on top of that. And good night. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to just periodically check that. There's the morgue right there. I see that. Well, I see you out here, actually. And you. Come on, then. Take a look at my frames real quick. That's pretty smooth. For this type of place. 50 frames. It is getting smoother since all the ashes and blood are gone. We're doing pretty good. Keith is surviving. I don't know if I could have done this if he only had one arm. I'll be real honest about that. It's unfortunate that mod broke, but it's also pretty lucky that that mod broke. Because now Keith can actually live on with both his arms still intact. He just have a grand old time. And wait, you're still flatline, that's good. Okay, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna periodically check. Just in case it starts going down. I think we're good for now, though. Okay, you guys are trying to repopulate up here. Can't be having that, no siree. Which way are you going? You going this way? Bop. Well, almost didn't see you, but I heard you. Hey, the fire has actually stopped. Come on, man. Double push. Oh, there's a drowsiness. Okay. Kill this group and then pull back immediately. Oh, there's two up here I can kill real quick. Three up here, actually. Come on, Keith. Killer. They ain't human no more. 30 shells remaining. Alright, let's head back home. We're not home, but you know, RV. On an RV trailer, I guess. Words are difficult sometimes. A lot of words for a lot of things. Kill you two real quick. Might have, yeah, I'm gonna check the radio as well. We gotta see when the rain is gonna start. Actually, or the thunderstorm's gonna start. Have a smoke before we head in, though. Alright, let's go. Back inside. Zombies after you? How can you tell, Keith? You got super senses. Keith, you really have to get inside that trailer. I don't want to catch you out here. There we go. Alright, let's see. Oh, lag. There we go. Radio. Device. Options. Bam. I can have it on full blast in here because there's nobody able to enter here. Let's have you sit on the bed, Keith. There you go. Well, we're going to have to wait until 9. Because the, the automatic broadcast is on every hour. By the hour. Or on the hour, every hour. Showers, a thunderstorm. I need to know the date. 35 degrees Fahrenheit. Dang. That's very cold. Not very cold, but it's cold, cold. Heavy cloud, no sun. Chance of a snowfall. Please tell me the thunderstorm. Separate failure. What does that mean? 
Wait, what does that mean? What? Is that, I don't, I don't know what that meant. I hope there's nothing serious. Oh, I just broke Keith. <laughs> Look at that, he's floating. There we go, fix it. Alright, well, I will go to bed. I'll see you guys when I wake up. I guess now Keith is automatically gonna try to punch you. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, I woke up sooner than I anticipated, and Keith is very drowsy. I need to grab a bottle of bourbon from the trunk. Please die. We are gonna have to go back home base because we are out of beta buckers, which means I can't really sleep in the, in the trailer. Where's my bourbon? One will do, I think. Okay, let me see if I can sleep, and then I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Alrighty, the thunderstorm seems to have passed for the, the thunder part of the thunderstorm, I guess. It's now just storming. Hmm. Well, I think we will take the rest of this episode just to try to get home. We do have to resupply. So let me see, I'm gonna grab the sledgy. So that we can break through the little fence here. Could probably just disassemble it, but these were metal fences, so I'm not too sure about that. Let me see. Nope, can't do it at all. Never mind. Time to destroy. Uh, I see here. Come on then. There we are. I can drop that bottle. Don't need it no more. The bourbon did work. Otherwise, we wouldn't really be here right now, would we? Let me see. Destroy. Come on. I don't want to hit you over the head with this nice ammo. Hey, another maintenance. What was that? Durability? That's new. I just It's just because I hit... What was this? Maintenance level 6. That's cool. Another trait to add to Keith's uh, little, little list there. Not little no more. I'll tell you what. You were doing that with the machete, Keith. I don't know how you did that. He's just too strong. Too capable. Alright, nice. That's done. Let me see. Yeah, that's still going up at the same rate. We have to redo those levels since he chopped the when you chop off his arm, I'm pretty sure I would have said this, but when you chop off his arm, his his strength and his, um strength and strength and fitness also went back down a level. So they both got a ways to go again. Alright, let's get out of here. I am also losing my my, my voice and is my overall will to speak, so I would do want to get home so that I can prepare for the next episodes. Oi, there we go. Should be pretty straightforward this way now. That's really the only the only bad part right there is the roadblock with all the cars. Hopefully this isn't too bad. Okay, it's it's kinda kinda iffy. There is quite a few out here. There's a bat on that guy's back, I saw that. I just want to get home. Home is where I need to be right now. Where Keith needs to be, he needs to rest up in his bed. Not be stuck in some cramped RV. Being terrified of what's in front of him or outside. But sleep, so I'll tell you what, sleeping in an RV trailer when I know there's Zeds, they can be outside. That is very terrifying. Because there's only one door out. If there's more than one Zed by that door, I'm screwed. Even if there is one Zed by that door, if he's on that door, I might get chomped on my way out. Not fun. But that's Zomboy for you. This is, in fact, how you die. And look at that. We're home. Just took one, one little rant from me. The wind is picking up a bit. Gotta deal with all these corpses again. Oh, it looks like the plants are coming along well. We have been gone a few days, I think. I'm not gonna worry about parking it right now. I just want it in. You yeah, gotta smoke first, there you go, Keith. Can't leave the, the vehicle and smoke at the same time. That's just too much brain power. Oh, let's check on the crops over here. See what's going on. Is that, they're looking real good. Seed bearing potatoes, nice. Cabbage is growing. Broccoli is not ready yet. They're not seed bearing. At least the corn's ready, but not seed bearing. I need seed bearing. Right. 
I did not mean to do that, but it seems like the tea stays planted, so that works for me. My seed bearing. I want seed bearing. Looks like most of them are seed bearing, except for that one on the end there. This one. Nice. Another level in farming. Looks like the tea leaves don't actually have a freshness to them, so that's good for me. Put these back away. And uh, then we have to put this in here for now. There we go. Okay, let's see what else we can do. Ooh, I can see things now. Let's go. I always thought that this was a mod, but no. If you just... What level farm you might? Level, farming level 4, you can just see things. With your eyes. Very cool. There we are. None of this is ready, right? Except for the corn and broccoli. But I need those to be seed bearing. Pack this up. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. Give me that back, please. Give me that. Anything else I'm missing? I don't think so. I think that was it. Alright. No. Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah. We're good. Alright, let's go put this stuff away. And then I'll send you guys off. Another successful day. It's good to be home. It really is. Right, we're gonna be leaving real soon. Go back out there. Let me actually let me go check out the front gate real quick. How are we looking? Crap. Crap, crap, crap. What happened out here? Is there a Zed on the base? That's a mannequin. Did they just break it and walk away? Yeah, was it you? Did you do it? Or was it your friend back there? What are y'all gonna tell me? I'm gonna torture you for it. I have to. Well, they didn't give anything up for it. Was it you? I'm telling you. I'm gonna figure it out. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to replace that gate off camera. Bop. Alright, let's just get back inside for now. Actually, we have a car battery charger now. I can take this. Oh, Jesus Christ, it was you. You guys did it. Definitely. Well, you guys get the shotgun. Destroy my gate. I don't know why I double pumps. I don't get it. I don't know if I broke something with my settings or not. Yeah, it was definitely them. I don't know where they came from, but it was it was definitely those three. Okay, I gotta worry about that now. I would do that off camera. We've got plenty of stuff to do it with. I just gotta go get the wood. Alright, well, let's put this stuff away like I intended to do before we get really interrupted. Here we are. I gotta go check the Jenny. I'll do that off camera. Get plenty of gas to do so as well. Put the potatoes away. I gotta get my weight back up. You know what? Let's eat a couple of these. These are good for weight. Along with the cabbages. Too full? Get okay, weight to not go up. That's fine though. We can deal with that later. Or I can deal with that later. It's uh, kind of boring for you guys to watch. Eat the tea leaves if I want to, but I want to make myself some tea and coffee later. Someday. Once I figure out how to do that. I think I know how. It's just, it's just a cup with water and then you put the coffee when it's heated and stuff. Or you make a cup of joe or something. Alright, well, uh, can I turn the lights on here? I think I can. Yes, okay, well, let's sit down. Have a rest. Keith has been through quite a lot. Let's check out his stats. There we are. Let's see. 76 weight, flatlined. Paper weapon is still the crowbar. 3,354 Zeds killed. Very nice. We have survived for 1 month, 16 days, and 19 hours. Cool. Well, if you like this type of stuff and you want to see more, make sure you hit that like button down below. And consider subscribing as well. It is free. You can unsubscribe whenever. And it helps me out a ton. Well, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Or next video, I should say. Peace.